Hello, hi everyone. Luciana and Awesome Sauce and Hit Points, Lovecraft and Void It QX and Lara and Francis and String of Pearls and Cali and so Freddy and uh, Daedalus, AJ Freeze, Hammer Rev, Clo uh, Resident Goblin, uh, Colleen, uh, Kayla, uh, Cat Jack, Moon Tsunami Spork, uh, 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 Francis and Bear Cowboy and Nat and Doctor. <laughs> Uh, Tommy D and Melba and Orkville and Ritza and Little Taco Cat, uh, uh, uh Dangu, Freed Monster, Breddy, Emiko, Vanilla Mike, Fun Time Pie, Maureen Zajic, The Ann Mine, uh, <coughs> <coughs> uh, Amanda, uh, KLL, um, The Simmer, uh, Cat Jack, hello everyone, Bento Omega, Just Balky, Reverend Cad, Petch Bench, Chef, Chef Kevin. Hello, Chef Kevin. How's it going? Um, we are, we're getting started. Um, this whole week we've been raising money for the bail project. Um, and, oh, thanks for the bits, Destructor. Uh, and we kind of organically started making characters for people for D&D. &D. Uh, if they gave a hundred dollars and it's kind of blown up more so than we realized it would I, the original goal was like two thousand dollars and we were over twenty two thousand dollars right now so that's fucking crazy um, and uh, this is all for you chef Kevin I just want to make sure you understand <laughs> uh, and here so so today's Friday we've been doing it a couple days and a couple people requested when I mentioned that Allie would maybe come on the stream, that Allie help with their characters. So we have about seven characters to do for that were specifically requested for Allie to help with. It's kind of, there's so many now that we unfortunately can't take more requests for Allie at the moment. Um, but and I will also get to the characters that we've, we have backlogged uh, over the next few weeks just because I've done maybe a fourth of what we have in the pile so uh once again shout out to the the zesbians for making this incredible uh character sheet um uh google doc that has all the people who gifted more than a hundred dollars uh twenty five thousand is going to happen today it simply is going to happen is what ghost Spear says i believe it i don't know we we're on pace for that um but yes uh here here we are we're gonna get started Let's do it. I gotta get Allie on a Zoom chat, and then we'll get going. Great. And at 30,000, I'll do another one shot of D&D &D on stream. Woo! Let's do it. <laughs> um, everyone doing good? Obviously, you know, maybe not good, but... All right, considering... This is the part of the stream where I click a bunch of windows. It's truly exciting stuff where I, um, I'm sort of just pressing buttons and getting lost in my computer for a little bit. Um, oh, this is what I needed to do. Ah, I'm gonna hide my screen because, you know, I keep showing people my email. Um, it's hidden, right? It's hidden? Yeah, okay, cool. Giving Allie the uh, Zoom info. Wait. Sent it to them. Great. Uh, all right. We're back in the Zoom. I'll text them to make sure that they know. Oh. Gosh, thanks everyone. We have 272 people watching, that's huge. Uh, I think I, I'm still bad about doing ads, but I think I'm gonna do another, like when I remember, do the ads because I'm just gonna donate the money from the ads. And if we have a lot of people, might as well just take that and put it towards the bail project. Hello, Bridget, good to see you again. 348, oh, yeah, it went up a bunch. <laughs> Amazing, thanks for uh, checking this out. If um, if you're new, uh, we are raising money for the bail project. There's a link below um, in that little channel area with the uh, different panels. 
uh, and quite bad weather keeps uh, posting it in the chat periodically so thanks for pre-rolls are on by the way cool is that that's good right for this purpose um we got it going y'all um let's see if Allie's joining us not yet but soon um subscribers do not see ads okay dude and that that the other thing i wanted to say was i love like on the discord you'll see that's where i once i we make a character we'll put the p character sheet in the discord but the community in the discord has done a, such a, a like a fun amazing job of drawing the characters like almost immediately that get made per our descriptions and then also like uh i think red paw did like wrote a song for his character or for their character and it is so good uh the tranger the etranger 13 thanks for the 50 dollars to the bail project and same with anonymous thank you so much tube jello thanks for the 10 bits made a crash thanks for the 100 bit bits <laughs> sorry uh let's go zesbians pride 100 hell yeah okay let's see where if we got any Nothing yet. Um, I will, let's see who's first. So technically Colleen is first, but Colleen, if you're here, I would love to get some people who haven't donated yet, which isn't necessarily fair to you, but um, I think we'll have time. We'll make, we'll make sure we get you eventually. Does that sound okay? Um, drinking some water for a thousand. First is Gwen. Okay, Gwen. Is Gwen? Hold on, sorry. Oh, tag Gwen. Okay, I see. Would like the character made with the alley if possible. Great. Thank you, Colleen. Um, yeah, we'll get Gwen going first. Tag Gwen. I don't know if you're in the chat right now. But uh, the, the only description on there was like, oh, and, and I, I think this is the other thing. I think I'm just going to do all of these that were requested for Allie, no matter what the stream, regardless of if the person is here, just because we just got to knock it out, baby. All right. Um. Oh, hi, Gwen. Hello. Let's see if we can get Allie on the horn. There we are. Okay, gotta put some headphones on. What's up? Oh, hold on. Hello? Hello? Hey. hey what up you may not be able to see me uh per the oh. camera being a weird thing i hope that's okay with you that's okay um <laughs> <laughs> trick question you're supposed to say i need to see <laughs> i need to see you zach um hello i don't know if you are in the zoom oh that that might be helpful if if you want to go to the twitch thing you can see my screen so for the character building sure. stuff um everyone's saying hi to Allie. Oh my god, Allie's hair. The hair is a vibe. Uh <laughs> <laughs> it is early. Right? It like feels early. I'm fucking tired. Are you tired? I'm exhausted. It's like I I have to, I feel like there's nothing wrong with acknowledging that it's just truly an exhausting week. Uh which is a privilege to only have it be a week. But, um, yeah, true, true, true. but you know, it's, there's been a lot of, it's been all consuming. <laughs> yes. Um, I think it's also like, I'm still getting used to what my tolerance is for like really grave videos. Yeah. Yeah. And, and that's watching compilations like right before bed of you know like people's experience getting detained and stuff like that and you're like so keyed up <laughs> i'm like doing push-ups like yeah, just like so mad all the time 
This, uh, this experience has radicalized me. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I, I tweeted something about this earlier today, but it was just like, I feel like everyone I knew went from not being sure what ACAB meant to wanting to get it tattooed on their forehead. <laughs> <laughs> Like, that's how much the Switch <laughs> is. Uh, that is so real. Uh, yeah. But, <laughs> you know, here we are. Um, let's just get started. We got mm. seven on the, the page for uh, characters uh, where you help make them. So we're starting with Gwen's Amazing. character. Um, I'm not sure if you can see the, the, the thing yet, but they just said they... Um, I I'm on, yeah. Okay. Uh, if possible, would like the character made with Allie. Great. Uh, Ted, Gwen, Gwen, do you have any specific... All I request is someone with glitz and glam, but simple enough for a novice player like me. Wow. Beautiful. The let's sentiment is beautiful. All right. So let's let's start with some race. We got some... We can do anything, you know? Amazing. Glitz and glam. I mean, first time, uh, first thing I'm noticing is sort of an Aarakocra or an Asimar. So like I a, was thinking Asimar, yeah. yeah but so like I a, would go for either. Yeah, let's. Um, I think we do. I think we do an Asimar, right? Just a glowing. Hell yeah. Uh, beautiful um, angel person. Mm-hmm. Um, beautiful. They got plus two to charisma. Wait, Not what are you on? I'm on D and D Beyond. Oh right! Oh, I don't think I've ever done the character before. <laughs> it's pretty good. I mean, it's like it's a nice way to explore the different options available. Yeah, um, I love a drop down menu. It it like because you know when you make your own character or whatever. Like if I'm doing it without something like this, I'll for sure do thirty percent of it wrong. Yeah. Hey, jacuzzi tubs, what's up? Um, <laughs> hey. Uh. Uh, Carolyn Page, aka Jacuzzi Tubs, in the chat, um, also Good been raising money. I think um, we are making a character. So we're going with the Protector Asimar. Maybe uh, they have a bunch of cool class. Or, I mean, uh, race features where they can like heal people just because of their race, and you know, oh that, cool. That's that's always going to be cool to have. Hell yeah, that's great. So a simple enough character. I feel like we could just go fighter, you know, because yeah. that's so straightforward for the most part. Um, yeah, I don't totally. know if, if anyone's listened to NADPOD. Um, you can have like a very simple character that's really effective, like uh, like a uh, hard one is his class is like uh, Jake Hurwitz's character um, is a I think it's a is it a champion fighter? So you just like do a, a ton of damage and you just are cool. Oh, we hit. We hit twenty three thousand. Hey. Every thousand dollars, I have to do a squat, and so That's we're getting great. a squat. Just one <laughs> you squat. You have to do a squat. <laughs> Sorry, one second. What? I'm not sure what you said, but I uh, got my headphones in now. Uh, pretty pretty tough to do these squats, and you know, like I think it's fun for people to make me do su such hard squats, so they should donate. Wow, uh, I w you know what I'm gonna go on record and say is that was a pretty shallow squat, but okay, yeah. Okay. So we've got a fighter here. We got this fighter going. <laughs> <laughs> so glitz and glam. I think um, acrobatics feels glitzy to me. Mm, mm -hmm. It's it's a you know you are when you can move specifically that's like your body's glitz and glam yeah and if you you add one sequin to that any sort of movement and bam yeah it's like kind of like Kristen appleby's with um the ribbon dancing oh, yeah, yeah, totally <laughs> that's glamorous yeah fabian with the sheet and me with the ribbon <laughs> we're both just so fluid <laughs> oh it's beautiful um uh now, now the other skills we can add: athletics, animal handling, history, insight, intimidation, perception, or survival. You know, not, maybe animal handling is good. Okay, what yeah. if we gave them like a really beautiful fox as a familiar? Ooh, mwah. I feel like that's perfect. It's I don't know how to do it on this website, but just know that you have a really beautiful <laughs> fox. Okay, 
I think that we should have that be clear. And it's like a natural beauty. Like there, she does, of course, have a smoky hey. eye. All foxes do. Jacuzzi but... tubs. Carolyn Page just gifted ten subs to the channel. Thank you so much. Hey. We'll make sure to do that. You know, put in the uh, cash value to the 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 tiltify. Appreciate it. Uh, it's awesome. Thank you so much. Gorge. Oh, you're doing you're doing sub cash value too. So yeah, well you know we have the bar where it's like you can uh, you can donate directly to the Tiltify, and I'm I, I'm trying to do my best to keep track of what I'm getting on per stream just to me so I can match that. But Very um, cool. uh, yeah yeah, so you know throwing some some stuff in there myself. Um, there we are. I mean offsetting it. It's not really my money. <laughs> uh, so fighting style. Um, archery, defense, dueling, great weapon fighting, protection, two weapon fighting. Hmm. Now, I think using two different weapons feels kind of, um, yeah. beautiful. Mm -hmm. There's a grace. Kind of a guardy vibe. Ooh, yes. Like, guardy, know, just, baby. You know, yeah. Yeah, just kind of like, we're doing this, if you can see. Um. They were like the most glamorous person, I'd say. Yeah. In all, of, in all of sophomore year. <laughs> okay, at third level. So this is what I was saying earlier. A champion's going to be pretty easy to play, because mm -hmm. like what your class feature there is that you get, you crit on nineteen and twenty not, instead of just twenty. So that's going to be dream. fun. That'll be really fun. Yep. Uh, we've gotten a lot of subscriptions. A lot. Uh, Evil Queen's rule. Thanks for gifting a sub. Um, man, uh, getting a lot. Appreciate it uh okay we got now now ali we've been doing a really fun thing for uh generating ability scores you know we were like strength dex constitution all that stuff uh -huh. um so originally i was doing four or five d6 just because you know i wanted the stats to be good and then it became a thing where it's like i don't know what if the stats are bad that's kind of funny uh and we've been doing 3d6 and then we went full chaos and we're rolling a d20 and that is now their ability score oh my god so it can be great it can be really bad do you happen to have a d20 nearby i do i do i think i got I mean, these new weird like mac and cheese looking <laughs> Nice, and I can't wait to use them for a character. Oh man! Well, hey, here we go. This is the perfect time. It's also fun because I don't know. I feel like you have a history of rolling hot, and yeah, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see. You know, this is pure chaos. I love this it. This is okay. First score, strength. Okay, rolling. We're rolling. <laughs> Are we rolling? Uh, we are rolling sound speed. <laughs> 18. 18! Okay! 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 Huge. Okay! Next score, dexterity. This is for Gwen. Six. <laughs> oh, no. I'm so sorry, Gwen. Uh, we might have to switch these two out. Uh, we can switch them later, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Next score, um, Constitution. Right. Two. Two? Okay. Pretty bad. Next score, Intelligence. Great. Oh, this is the good one. Five. <laughs> we can re-roll some of these. We can re-roll some of these. Let's get one mulligan roll in here, too. All right, good, good, right. Wisdom. Nine. Is a nine. Charisma. All right. Ten. We can reroll one of these, right? Let's reroll <laughs> one. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Constitution being three con? is like you'll get sick and die if you yeah. go outside. <laughs> Fifteen. Fifteen. Great. All right. Oh. We're going to change this, the dex to 18 and the strength to six because... If you're dual wielding, I think those are finesse weapons, which will yeah. be a dex thing. Totally. Great. So these are the stats. Love it. Uh, I wish I could have done better, and I am sorry. <laughs> Gwen, it's going to be okay, because you you got some pretty beefy other stats. So, yeah, you know, everyone like everyone, we have flaws. 
Some of us only have half the intelligence other people have. <laughs> <laughs> now, Gwen's character, let's start thinking, I mean, you don't have to have a name right now, but if you happen to have a name for sort of a, um, a glamorous Christian warrior, uh, Ooh. or, you know, not Christian, but... Uh, you know, <clears throat> that puts me in the right, you know, pool. I think that's a fun zone. I uh, <clears throat> fully inhaled some coffee, so sorry. Hey, take your time. Take your time. Uh, I'll, I'll stall. We are, we're we're going to talk about a background in a second. Oh. So I think, right, yeah. I think I need to, to like, um, dive into who this glamorous warrior is. Um, cool. Let's see. Let's see. We got, you know, there's so many options. And entertainers jumping out to me. Ooh, that's very that's... glamorous. Definitely. I mean, that's got to be it. Right? I think it's entertainer. Yeah, it's got to be entertainer. Okay, you thrive in front of an audience. You know how to entrance them, entertain them, and even inspire them. Your poetics can stir the hearts of those who hear you, awaken grief or joy, laughter or anger. Okay, um, you know, yeah. go with me on this one. Yes, yes, please. The name is Jessica Lang. <laughs> okay, is it L A N G E? Wait, oh yeah, let's look it up. Jessica Lang. Now, uh, do we want... L-A-N-G-E, yeah. Jessica Lang, the battle angel? Yeah. The answer is yeah. The answer is that, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Did you know she was a model before she started acting? Jessica Lang was a mom. I mean, she, I've only known her as sort of like, you know, her, the later half of her career. Exactly, probably. yeah. I think our generation is like, oh, yeah, she's an like, amazing actor on American Horror Story. Yeah. Um, uh, that, I'd buy it. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh. Someone is saying Je Jessica Langel. Oh. Jessica yeah. Langel, the battle angel? The battle angel. <laughs> <laughs> the battle angel? <laughs> oh, perfect. There we go. Okay, now we got to choose some skills. Okay, great. Skill proficiencies, performance. Yep. Uh, and then we have a couple, a bunch of other things. It weirdly doesn't show people the drop down menu that I see. But uh, we're looking at arcana, athletics, deception, history, insight, intimidation, investigation, medicine, nature, perception, persuasion, religion, sleight of hand, stealth, survival. We can choose two of these. Oh, no, sorry. We only have one. Oh, we only have one. Okay, what do you think? You know, if it's a battle angel, athletics will always be good. But yeah. there's something interesting about religion or something else, too. <laughs> oh, true. You know, I do kind of think athletics just because those roles could have been better. <laughs> so we'll, we'll beef them up there. We'll beef you up a little bit. But just know in your mind that you know a lot about religion as well. Yes, yes, exactly. <laughs> as, as a player. Now, of course, uh, you have the tool proficiency of a disguise kit as an Ooh. entertainer. And then you can also choose a musical instrument. Oh, So amazing. bagpipes, drum, dulcimer, flute, horn, lute, lyre, pan flute, chom, or viol. I mean, I definitely am seeing a flute yes. as a weapon and that being like pretty glamorous. So you're, we're, okay, we're going to flavor, this is, I think this is what it is. We're going to give them two like finesse swords, but uh -huh. they are flavored as flutes. Oh my God. Incredible. Right? Yeah. Okay. There's all these. So you could even be playing and the sword is coming out and you just and dice someone while you still are playing the flute yeah yeah i think that's good it's sort of a bard but not you know yeah yeah <laughs> double um, flute chaotic good wait what why does it say i'm a sucker for a pretty face <laughs> oh this is like this like you know the weird kind of like if you i like you know we are so used to character creation that involves like us like I don't know. I think we approach character as like, oh. you know, comedians and actors and improvisers. Like, so we kind of don't ever really use these, yeah, but these are kind I of like it. stock things. If you kind of, I don't know, uh, need a little more guidance in terms of like what your character is. Wow. So that's how the game can kind of help someone who 
maybe doesn't know where to start with that stuff. Wow, crazy. Yeah. yeah. Um, so here we are. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, so w let's not worry about that. Let's just make our own stuff. Um, what would yeah, you say yeah. this person's faith is? Ooh. Oh, um, what do you think? Jessica Langle, the battle angel. Uh, oh, battle angel, excuse me. Um, <laughs> flutes, uh, music is my god. I don't know. Oh, music is my boyfriend? <laughs> Their face... <laughs> music is my boyfriend yeah <laughs> okay <laughs> great and their lifestyle i think they're really rich oh yeah they're wealthy yes they're so, they're like self-made wealthy though oh wow i think i like that that's cool um Gwen is saying girlfriend. We'll switch that out. Oh, yeah, let's do it. Okay, Gwen. Music is my girlfriend. I love it. Okay, uh, we can throw some hair, like some hair, skin, eyes, that kind of stuff. Love it. Um, hair, white. <laughs> do you have any strong opinions on any of this? Ooh. Okay, so we're picturing like it's just a gorgeously glamorous battle angel. Battle yeah. Angel. Battle Angel. And I'm seeing blue, honestly. Okay. Hell yeah. Blue. I'm seeing blue hair, skin, eyes. Blue, blue, blue. Height, but, blue. Uh, and then there's like some like some some flair because I feel like if you put some like gold with blue, it's gonna look really good. Some silver with blue, it's gonna yes. look really good. Yes, and that's just like in terms of the the armor, the clothing. Mm -hmm. uh, would you say I'm blue? Abu di babu die. Abu di. If I was uh, green, I think I would die. Yes, yes. <laughs> so six foot I four. Six foot four. <laughs> Height. I'm putting six foot four. Uh, I love it. My height. Yeah. Yeah. Allie's height. Mm -hmm. yeah. Let's say like, I don't know, uh, uh, 200 pounds. <laughs> yeah. Great. For battle, six four? Freaking yeah. battle angel. Age. Yeah. Maybe like, I don't, I want to say like 200 years old. Okay. I don't know. Each year they've gained one pound. <laughs> <laughs> uh, gender wise. Gwen, I wasn't sure if there's anything you wanted to do, but I would. I think I was just gonna leave it blank if you wanted yeah, to, to throw yeah, that in there. Um, this person is fluid. They're we're fluid, fluid baby. water. Now we're gonna go th put some chain mail. Feels right. Yes. Uh, chain Hot. mail. Leather armor. This is so BDSM. <laughs> All right. So do we go leather armor? But I think the silver makes more sense, right, for this character. We've given yeah. a couple of characters some BDSM. No, no, armor. no. I, I like chainmail too. Yeah. Martial weapon is two martial weapons. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna make them. Obviously, flute's not gonna be here, but we're gonna use uh like the like let's do scimitars. Ooh. And uh, you can, we can flavor those as flutes. Yeah. Okay. Incredible. They got a light crossbow maybe, and that is uh that light crossbow is a violin. <laughs> <laughs> Just a full one person band. Beautiful. Musical instrument of your choice. We're getting a flute there, of course. Now, this is a little entertainer starting equipment. So you can say they also have a love letter, a lock of hair, or a trinket. Oh. Any of these jumping out to you, flavor wise? Oh, that's so interesting. Yeah, okay. So music is my girlfriend. I would imagine a love letter. Mm hmm. A love from... letter. Your sweet girlfriend. AKA music. So it's sheet music. Their love letter is sheet music. Oh my gosh, stop it. And what song is it? For Elise. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, weren't you learning to play piano for a while? Ali, I can't get into it. I just can't get <laughs> I got I got an app that I was trying to teach myself piano off of. Yeah, that would have been great. It was fine, but like, <laughs> and I kind of got, I fell off, and then I realized I'd been paying for this app for months. And then Wait, I, so you're paying for Jib Job and a piano app? Allie, I said I can't get into it. <laughs> I can't. 
Um, I'm not trying to bully you, okay? Not well, really. it kind of feels like... I'm not. Um, here, let's... Okay, so we're going into... Let's add an item. We can just throw in a full, like, a cool magical item. So let me look for, like... I don't know. Maybe there's some glamorous shit to throw in there. Oh, yeah. Good call. Glam. Glamored studded leather. What is that? Wow. You can use the armor's command word and cause the armor to assume the appearance of a normal set of clothing. You decide what it looks like. That's pretty magical. It's incredible. That is so cool. Let's add it. And it's rare. Let's freaking add it. And then... I don't know. What are these living gloves again? Ooh. Uh, while attuned to these gloves, you are proficient with the flute. And when you make an ability check using them, you double your proficiency bonus to the check. Huh. That's pretty interesting. I don't quite, I kind of don't get it, I'll say. I think this person just knows the flute. Yes. I don't think they need the gloves. Maybe something with wind. Can you do the filter with wind? Incredible. <laughs> uh, winter's dark bite. What is this? You have a plus one. Huh. It doesn't quite say anything. Okay, wind vane is a spear. This is like legendary. So Whoa. this is like a game breaking weapon to have. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But I think we're just going to give it to you, right? Uh, why not? <laughs> so this is your spear yeah. that's also a giant flute. You can pull it out. So you have to roll a D10 or a D100. And if you get uh, the bottom, or you get the top 5%, you get to use it for three rounds. How about that? Whoa. Yeah, that's great. Wow. You, wow. Incredible. Okay, wait. Oh, I gotta, I gotta attune it. Wait, what happened to it? Did I add it? Wind vane? Hold on. Do we already? Oh, oh. Let's just pretend you have one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, let's view that character sheet. Wow. Okay, so of course negative two strength plus four to dexterity. <laughs> Plus two to constitution, negative three intelligence, zero wisdom, uh, plus one to charisma. Despite the negative three intelligence, self-made, um, self-made business person. Yeah. I just realized I forgot to add some of this in inventory stuff. We're, we're going to wear that. Um, great. Our buzzer is so horrifying. <laughs> Your buzzer? At our house, oh, okay. like when people are downstairs at our apartment. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, here we are. I think we got a pretty sick character going. Um, yeah. Gwen, I hope you enjoy it. Yeah. Um, all right. I'm going to export it to the, the when I, this is the first one we've done today. So to find it, go to the Discord link at the bottom. I'm just putting them in the general chat there. Oh, cool. What's the Discord? So the Discord's just like a personal Discord that I have for this uh, Twitch channel oh, uh, cool. where people who, you know, uh, want to want to hang out here um, Love it. can continue to do so offline. And then, have you, you know, heard of that app community? That like service where you get a phone number? Um, community service where you have you get a phone number no I don't yeah think... it's like it's this new thing i don't know i read anyway it was just some article that i read that it was like people are like i guess ashton kutcher is like an early adopter of it and he just tweeted like hey everyone please don't call me anymore just text and put his real phone number Whoa. and i guess it was all through this like company that gives people phone numbers where instead of like dming on like an app or a platform it moves it all just to straight phone huh i don't know yeah is that better I was reading about it before this um i'm gonna read some donations real fast uh Ooh. anonymous thanks for the five dollars these are all to the the bail project uh grace keen thanks for the 20 anonymous thanks for 20 uh how many pockets thanks for the 25 turbo tim tom uh thanks for the 100 uh uh 
Al, this is just um, Turbo Tim Tom. Fortunately, Allie and I have sort of a backlog of characters we're supposed to do, but they, uh, they were wondering if you could share Kristen Appleby's perspective on how to make a bugbear who is seeking advice to, to for how to talk to his Republican family about racial, <laughs> racial justice. It separately, has alopecia, but that doesn't define them. Uh, we maybe won't be able to make that character today, but I just want to acknowledge uh, that situation. Yeah, um, that's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Envy Divine, thanks for the tier one. We made Envy's character uh, last time or the day before. Um, let's see. Joe McShanky, thanks for the 100 uh, for the uh, for the project. I'm reading this right now. We'll get to it probably another day, unfortunately, but thank you. Um Unsleeping City vibes there. Cool. Uh, Zach the Goliath guy, thanks for the 50. Um, uh, cool. Uh, Office Space-esque monk. Cool. Um, here we are. Okay, great. Um, I see your other 50. Monk, that's yes. so funny. Yeah. Okay, cool. Well, um, we're, get we're getting on to Luciana, the next one. Uh, Woo! okay great 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 um let me i have to do this weird thing where i hide my screen for a second for some reason um you just check your bank account and yeah get I, some stuff done i check my bank account and be like okay pretty much the same uh <laughs> <laughs> looks the same uh okay we're on to character number two and we can you know uh, Luciana, um, what what are your hopes and dreams? Any any things that you're hoping to avoid? I wonder if is Luciana around? Just double checking. So there's a community of um, what has what they've labeled themselves as as zespians, aka. Zach lesbians or there's a, a thing in this channel where people put z in front of different words and uh they they've been very helpful in uh organizing this character sheet uh uh chaos uh we love and six, it. six out of the seven requests are from the zespians <laughs> we love it we love it <laughs> oh luciana wrote it in the spreadsheet okay cool uh let me find that I've been see yeah I've been seeing a lot of hashtag lesbians for Zach Oyama, which is uh, uh, truly inspiring. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's like I I mean I'm I'm so uh, touched by that. I, did I expect specifically that hashtag? Not really. Yeah. Um, so Luciana, I, I would love the most beautiful, powerful lesbian barbarian paladin or fighter. I normally only play half orc spellcasters and want to try something totally different. Uh, also, I'm begging Zach. Please make her playable. I am begging. Okay, so we will <laughs> we'll reroll some stats if need be. Um, okay, okay, okay. So this is not not the most different starting zone than what we just had. But let's say, you know, we haven't. I don't think we've made an elf yet. Oh, cool. Should we make an elf? Just like a super strong elf. Yeah, I love yeah, it. A high elf or something. I had to read some like wild erotica for uh, <laughs> uh, Reiko's show, Reiko and Jess's show. Were you oh, ever wow. on that? I did that once, yes. It was like, uh, what's it called? The um, Erotic Book Club? Yeah, Erotic Book Club. Yeah, yeah. Um, so now that I'm looking at all these different options of elves, there's a little more creativity here than I, I first thought of. There's like a sea elf. Oh, very so like a like I think it's like almost like the beauty of a mermaid, right? There's something oh, fun that's there. That's cool. Um, I really like that actually. Yeah, let's do that. As a very water sign, I two thumbs up to the sea elf. Oh wow, daughter, uh, dangers from the depths. Well, I threw in daughter like a like a creep. Uh, <laughs> Child of the sea, friend of the sea, CL training, constitution. Okay, so you get Dax to this. Um, maybe that makes me speed pretty cool. Okay. Wait, what was that advantage on saving throws against what? 
Oh, I didn't even see. Where do you remember what category? Uh, down. Oh yeah. Let's take a peek. Quick peek. Keen senses, maybe. Proficient. Oh, ability. Yeah, advantage. Oh, fey ancestry. You can't advantage on saving throws against being charmed, and you, and you can't be put to sleep. Very cool. Sick. That's very cool. So you got plus two to dex, but I don't think that should limit us. I think we should go freaking barbarian. Yeah. Um, oh yeah. <clears throat> Add class. Absolutely. Um. So this powerful C person, we're looking at them right now. We got some abilities to choose from. Uh, they what we know about them. Let me look at the thing again. They're just I know that they're beautiful. Uh, uh, beautiful, powerful lesbian barbarian. Okay, so let's just do athletics and int intimidation. Oh yeah, great. I feel like those oh. are uh, the beauty. I mean, beauty is often intimidating. Mm -hmm. And also, being super strong is intimidating. <laughs> I love this vibe of like they're so strong and capable, but then they can play the character. However, yeah, you know, like that's you know only strength. one facet of their. <laughs> their personality so uh primal path as a barbarian you know like every class you have the subclasses and you have different paths um there's a bunch of different ones like berserker is gorgug um uh i think i think storm herald is uh king rocks um Totem oh, Warrior yeah. is uh, Siobhan's character on NADPOD. Um, I think S Storm Herald sounds cool with the sea vibe, right? Yeah, totally. Um, is there anything else jumping out to you? Any other vibes? No, I love that. I okay. love that. A cool. Storm Herald sea elf? Like, Ooh, sea is literally a choice you can have in here. Whoa. Uh, starting at third level, you emanate a stormy magical aura with your rage. That's really sick. So it's... this, I mean, I can imagine, like, if you're playing and you're not around, like, bodies of water, you can still use these abilities. Yeah. Water everywhere. Well, it doesn't, you don't necessarily need water to do them, too. Oh, it's great. almost, like, magical, you know, like, if you were to create water or something. Uh, and it's, like, and it's seemingly more about, like, the flavor of it than anything. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. These are great. Yeah, these are great abilities. You get, you okay, get like cool. target takes one d six of lightning damage on a failed save. That's cool. Incredible. Like a stormy sea. Cool. Now is the most important part. We are going to roll some stats, and Here we, we are, go. Luciana has bagged us to make them play. We'll not let you down, Luciana. Okay, do you understand? Ready? Great. God. Oh God. <laughs> Go away. Um, we got it. We're back. <laughs> so, uh, how'd that go? You can. It's I guess a sixteen. It what? I don't know what you're referring to, but that is. A it's 16. a sixteen. Great. Uh -huh. We'll count it. We'll count it. We'll count the good ones that hit the ground. Ooh, fourteen. Okay. Also very good. Constitution. At Twenty. Woo-wee! The first one, honey. I gotta override this nat 20. Hold on one second. That's a nine. <laughs> nine intelligence? That's fine. Yeah. We got wis wisdom coming up. Oh, and one more. Oh, two Ooh. more, I think, right? That's an 18. Holy shit. And that's an eight. Okay. All right. You know... Playable. Let's say, should we switch charisma and wisdom? Because, huh. I feel like wisdom is eight, charisma is 18 if they're beautiful, intimidating. I think you're right. Does that make sense? Yeah, I mean, like, yeah, having intelligence and wisdom being pretty low, though, is kind of hard. Hmm. What are they going to be trying to do? You know what, though? Okay, I will say I kind of like Wisdom 18, Charisma 8, just because I feel like when you're, like, a super hot gay person, you're less palatable. <laughs> <laughs> the world is like, I don't get it. So you're, you're I'm sorry, so you're suggesting Wisdom is 18 and, and the Charisma 8? Charisma is 8. 
Okay, that makes sense. Because then they're like not a, a like an obnoxious person. It's yeah, you're not only like trying to be like. Yeah, yeah, they're really yeah. wise. Maybe not like book smart. Um. Uh, I I just happened to notice this on the uh general chat but i just want to throw it out to uh just because i haven't communicated this person as well as i could justin i can't really uh i'm gonna do all the alley ones right now and we and, you know unfortunately couldn't like uh do anything off stream really right now um but if if you're willing to wait it'll be like it'll probably be where we have 70 backlogged and it's taking like 20 minutes of a character <laughs> so just throwing that out there if you're asking for a character right now it's going to take a minute uh, but appreciate your patience. Um, cool. Uh, great. Now, here we are. What what we, what do we feel like the name of this character is? Oh, this is great. So it's this sea mermaid like elf, right? That's a powerful warrior. Okay, I want to say the hottest women. I I just feel like when I was growing up, there was a girl named Corey. Oh. And I thought it was really hot that she had a guy's name. Is so there what's anything just like the to... most man's name ever? Is there anything to Corolly? Ooh. <laughs> Does that sound too stupid? How about Coraline? <laughs> Coral. Coraline? Coraline. That... Uh, that's fun, right? <laughs> I don't know if that's lame. I'm trying to backtrack a little bit. I can't tell. I can't tell either. Let's think of just maybe I don't have to bring in the C here. Shelly okay. is funny. Okay. Shelly. Shelly. Oh. Um, I just want to get this right, so I don't want to rush this. Okay. I got a pitch. Yeah. Roger Shelly. Roger Shelly, baby. She goes by Roger. She's a fucking hot mermaid person. She delights that everyone is confused. I love it. Wake up, people. Wake up, sheeple. Wake up, sheeple. My name's Roger. <laughs> what? So what? So what? Um. I can't. Okay, yeah. Dr. So, Roger Shelley, is that insane? Yeah, but. Okay. <laughs> but we'll put it there. They can. We'll put it. They can. They can. I'll put it in parentheses. So it's like. You don't have to mention it, but you can. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, her intelligence is low. Yeah. Um, so it's up to you to decide if you believe the doctor part. So background, there's a bunch of stuff. <laughs> I think a pirate makes sense. Oh, is yeah, that too totally. on the nose, though? Do we want to give them some just sort of like clashing character? Not like clashing, but like some. Yeah, okay, okay. Some add some lo like uh, grain to it. Actually, I really do like pirate. I think that's cool. Interesting. Let's do it. Um, skill proficiencies. Okay. Um, let's say you know we can get interesting. This character's stats are insane. So why don't we just do interesting things here? Um, we could do religion. We could do. I like that. They know about. Uh, insights cool. I, yeah, I think anything that falls more under the category of wisdom than intelligence, and I think yeah. religion is a great one for that. Um, Persuade. Per, uh, let's see. Insight is intelligence, unfortunately, right? I think. Oh, is religion intelligence also? I think so. Oh, that's so annoying. Um, medicine is wisdom, I think. Oh, cool. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wait let me pull up my character sheet i think i have one on my desktop is deception uh, wisdom based insight is wisdom okay cool great i forget oops all right launched hearthstone it's good to see you again <laughs> <laughs> uh let's add some notes here let's character details choose alignment chaotic good seems right Everyone's yeah. chaotic good. Faith. Uh, can we hear a little bit about a faith, Alec? What's up? We're looking for a faith, you know? Okay. Faith in myself. Uh, faith in... 
Okay, so she's water. She's water. Faith in the future. Faith in the future. Um, she's chaotic good, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You love to see it. Um, wealth. Modest, comfortable, wealthy, aristocratic, poor, squalid, wretched. Any of these jumping out? I'd say honest. I like that. Modest? Or, I'm sorry, it's, it's, um, Oh, it's wealth. modest. That's hilarious. Let's um, say comfortable. They're just comfortable. Love it. Physical characteristics. Um, a lot of blues here, too, I think. Blue, blues yeah. and greens. We can kind of go... Maybe okay, it's... let's do seafoam hair. Seafoam hair. Skin is um, cerulean. <laughs> Love it. Eyes. Hmm. hmm. I mean, is it psycho to say red? No, I love it. I think that's really stunning. Yeah. Okay, I have my character sheet. I'm locked in. Here we are. Now here I we can are. answer now, some of these questions. Right? Height. I think they're also pretty tall. Uh, as an elf? Yeah. Well, I mean, not necessarily as an elf, but like, I'm just picturing a, um, you know, a barbarian that is, but maybe they're not tall. I mean, how tall do you think they are? Yeah, I don't know. Two feet tall? Um. Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, yeah yeah let's say um let's say six feet just a classic six feet um oh, shit, I, put my... I was wondering what was going on okay yeah let's say six feet two feet tall uh you know <laughs> please make this playable and in the very 11th hour we're like you're two feet tall okay <laughs> moving on. age uh 20 love it gender whichever whatever yeah, what do we want? Um, or have you just not been filling that I'm out? I'm just not filling that out and just letting it's people... So, it's going to look so dated to like yeah. our kids. Yeah, that you have to... Why is it on here? Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine being like in the year 3000 and hearing that there were like gender segregated bathrooms? <laughs> no. The year 3000? <laughs> I hope we have bathrooms in the year 3000. I, yeah, everyone just has their own personal bag personal catheters i have a little teleporter under my um under me uh yeah. okay a barbarian starting equipment a great axe any martial weapon Ooh. um i'm picturing a glaive that sounds cool ah, yeah it's a, it's been a word that's been on the brain a lot lately you love a glaive wait a glaive is like a full it's like a big staff with a big, like, almost like sword-like blade on the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We're Googling glaive, honey. Uh, two hand axes oh, yeah. is cool. Very cool. Uh, a blank pen, 50 feet of silk rope. <laughs> the pirate starting equipment's very funny. Okay, a rabbit foot, a small stone with a hole in the center, or a trinket. <clears throat> who is this person small stone with a hole in the center it feels really uh centering to have something yeah. like that it also feels kind of like something that could have washed up on the beach and you picked up yeah and then you just have it forever yeah okay now we're <clears throat> gonna add a magical item of some kind hell yeah um what let's see if there's any like uh, I don't feel too crazy about that. Um, I like the cloak of displacement. It's like a thing that makes it hard, hard for people to hit you. Oh my god, sick. They have disadvantage on attacks until they hit you. What? Yeah. Oh, that's insane. I my, love that. My character on Nadpod, Maverus, has this. It's very sick. Amazing. I'm just trying to make this character badass. Yeah. Uh, Freaking badass. Wielding a glaive. <clears throat> Incredible. 
No one can hit Dr. Roger Shelley. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor. Oh, gosh. Okay, great. So I think we're pretty much done. Amazing. Uh, view character sheet. Let's see the stats on this. Dr. Roger Shelley. It's a C elf barbarian level three. Uh, plus three to strength, plus three to dex, plus five to constitution, minus one to intelligence, plus four to wisdom, minus one to charisma. I love it. They got this glaive. They're just fucking people up with that. You love they have it. have a sick cloak. We Can really Can you did give, it. like, wait, okay, what was the, what was the want again? It was, like, a beautiful... Yes, let's look at it. Um, beautiful, strong lesbian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, um... I would love the most beautiful, powerful lesbian, barbarian, paladin, or fighter. I normally only play half orc spellcasters and want to try something totally different. Also, I am begging Zach, please make this character play. <laughs> I think okay, there's some sort playable. of ability that we can give to her where, like, when she like teams up with other queer characters, there's some sort of like power boost between all of them. Ooh, yes. I love that. She can vibe. maybe she can give other queer characters advantage on a roll as a bonus yeah, action. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. I love it. A knowing glance. A Let's knowing go. glance. <laughs> I can't write it down on the character sheet, but know that that is true about your know character. Know that that is true. Knowing glance, you give advantage on one roll to another queen. Beautiful. I love this. <laughs> uh, okay. Dr. Roger Shelley. Goodbye, doctor. The doctor is in. <laughs> God. Uh, okay. Um, we will, I'm gonna hide the screen again. Who's next? Do we know who's next? Um, mm, I need a, more coffee, but I'll wait for yes. a second. Go, you, go, I think now's a good time to go get it. I can read some <clears throat> stuff off. You love to see it. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, click this off. And we're gonna... Uh, Uptime, we've been going for, uh, how long have we been going? An hour? Yeah. Uh, we've done uh, two characters. <laughs> <laughs> this takes so much longer than I thought it would. Yeah. Uh, Maybe for 100 bucks. Hey, it is. It's 100 bucks. You have to, and that's why yeah. it takes longer because you just have to like respect the cash that has been thrown down. <laughs> um, just, so next up would be. I believe it's Colleen, but Colleen, if we could do you slightly later, uh, that would be ideal, if you don't mind. Uh, Pearl? Is Pearl around? Pearl or Caroline? Incredible, Louisiana. Um, I'm also going to grab another coffee appreciate it one sec hi pearl uh we'll get with you in just a second i guess you're okay so caroline is it's lars of the stars so who's actually so we'll go pearl then caroline sound good all right i'm gonna get some coffee Coffee's going. Hello. Kelsey Rodish, thanks for the $100. Um, thank you for donating. I love any character. Uh, whatever you feel like thinking would be fun. Kelsey, thank you so much. Um, again, you know... I know Twitch is weird because, like, you can just come in whenever and not saying that this is not um, – I just want to clarify for everyone. 
if you're if you're just jumping in we have like 80 characters to go so we're a little backlog i'm just going to keep doing them as you know for the next few weeks i think just because i can't literally can't uh i could probably hit the seven maybe that we have listed for ali and i today but um uh we'll get to you eventually thank you kelsey um i'm gonna run an ad while i wait for my coffee just to do it for this okay well um thanks to all the subs who are here too um Let me read Pearl's thing. Cool. Pearl, just looking, uh, I will be doing this for the rest of the life. Yeah, I think after Sunday, I'm just gonna, despite it being an insane amount, uh, I'm gonna keep it open through Sunday. Uh, we'll probably cut it off at Sunday. Zach is the best, says Twitch. Is that actually Twitch? <laughs> Hello, Twitch. Um, hello, uh, we're, we're raising money for the bail project today by making D and D characters. And it seems like I'll be doing this for the rest of my life. We're back, baby. Allie, <laughs> it seems like the literal Twitch is in the channel. <laughs> Wait, what? The, I, uh, conversing with the account Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> um, That's Allie's funny. back. I, oh, I'm going to grab my coffee and then we'll get started on string of pearls. Twitch, um, welcome. I'm going to grab my coffee. I'll be right back. Yeah. How's everybody doing? Do we have a chat? I can't find it. I can only see the donations. Oh, I'm in the chat, baby. I found it. Hey. Yeah, okay. Twitch, make Zach a partner. Twitch. Hey, Twitch. I saw your stream and just listened to the NADPOD episodes with you, and it was like, hell yeah. Oh, thank you, Twitch. I'm so confused. There's just an account that's literally Twitch? Is that official? Insane. No way. Oh my god. I personally, the person currently on the Twitch account do not have control over that. <laughs> no worries. Hey, get fired. Get fired <laughs> and make Zach a partner. <laughs> Yeah, if you could, uh, yeah, if you could um, <laughs> lose your job just to give me that little check mark, that would be great. No, oh, just do it. Um, just kidding. Uh, Wait, if you work there though, really, is there a way for us to like get Zach to be a partner though? Oh, cool. You got. You will be email. Okay, thank you. Pretty hey. appreciate that. Oh, Ify. Yeah, Ify's doing some stuff. Has been doing stuff on Twitch for a long time. Um, yeah very cool that's exciting thank you so much for chatting and um i'm glad you like uh nadpod and, and d20 stuff um let's get this going we got to get right, some more characters done we got to pick up the pace slightly i'm afraid. okay yeah let's do show it. us your email again zach i i really might accidentally do that in the next i don't know two minutes because it, it's been a theme um <laughs> you accidentally show your email <laughs> Yeah, it's been bad. It's been bad. <laughs> so Pearl's character. Pearl, did you have any um, uh, anything going on that you wanted to, like any character details that you were hoping to, to stay away from, include? My only request is something other than a bard, cleric, or sorcerer, because I already have multiple of each of those. Bard, cleric, sorcerer. Okay. Okay. Do you want, uh, Ali? What are you feeling? Maybe a druid. That's fun. Uh, Bard cleric. Oh, did we? We didn't bit? pick a class. Did we pick a race? Oh, so we got to pick a race too. Um. Hmm. Did a lot of minotaur stuff yesterday. 
What about a kinku druid? <laughs> is that too weird? Um, I don't hate it. Is that a bird person? A little bit of a bird person? I mean, I Haunted love by an ancient crime that robbed them of their wings, the kinku wander the world as vagabonds and burglars who live on the edge of human society. Wow. That's incredible. Haunting. Um, kinku training. Oh my gosh. Acrobatics. I simply want to be a kinku next time we play. <laughs> uh, so a haunted bird. You, okay. You're essentially a crow, right? Uh, like, yeah. Or An what? acrobatic crow. I guess crows don't necessarily think that they are, ooh, uh, you know, are crows. I mean, are, are haunted, right? They're just, I'm a bird. You guys are yeah. putting that on us. They are definitely all haunted, but they're not aware of it. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so acrobatics. Uh, what Acrobatics, deception, sleight of hand, stealth. These are the kinku trainings. <laughs> so we have to choose two. Um, Acrobat. I mean, I think this... Oh, stealth is really cool. Stealth. Uh, or acrobatics and stealth. Yeah. Mimicry. You can mimic sounds you've heard, including voices. Oh. This is... What a creepy vibe. Yeah. Um, there was a bird near my, like, dorm room when I was in college that its call was... Mom? Oh, I got a dab. It sounded like a little kid. Oh, no. That's horrible. It sounded like a little kid looking for their mom. And we, like, looked forever and then found out it was a bird. That's like Hunger Games. Rachel Lirias, <laughs> thanks for the five tier one subs. Appreciate it. Um, Let's go through it. Let's do it. Uh, mm -hmm. Level three. Proficiencies. Druidic, dru choose a druid skill. Um, Oh, there's a beautiful Jessica Langle uh, art in the Discord. We'll check it out after this character. Oh my god. Um, Druid, it feels like nature is going to be a thing. Definitely. Uh, and then outside of that, uh, animal handling? I was going to say animal handling. Yeah. yeah. Let's do it. Great. Um, it's a crow who's really good at animal handling. They can wild shape into a man. <laughs> I love. I love. Oh my gosh. Druid cool. circle. So there's all these circles. Circles of... Circle of dream, circle of land, and it's a bunch of specific places. Circle of the moon, circle of shepherd, circle of spores. Circle of spores is what Emily's character is on NADPOD. Um, oh, and that's very cool. Uh, I think circle... that's really cool. Is huh? it moon? Circle of the moon? Let's see what that... Combat wild shape. When you choose the second... Uh, the circle at second level, you gain the ability to use wild shape on your turn as a bonus action rather than an action. That's a very good skill. That's crazy. Um, oh, and you regain hit points. That's pretty cool. You regain hit points? Oh, additionally, while yeah. you transform a watch, you gain a bonus action to expend one spell slot to regain 1d8 hit points. So per it's like level. more about like the battle-y... Yeah. Animal shapes. I think that's cool. I think that's really cool, yeah. Yeah, Circle of the Moon is all about the battle, the wild shapes. Okay, Allie, we've reached that time again where it's time to roll some ability scores. All right, I'm just going to roll them six in a row. Okay. I, I, I'm Strength. Seven. Okay. Dexterity. Eighteen. Wow. Constitution. Seven. Okay. Intelligence. Eleven. Wisdom. Four. Okay. <laughs> Carissa? Focus up, focus up. A 16. Okay. Now, let's reroll that four just to see. Good call. It's a six. Oh, wait, no, sorry, it's a nine. <sighs> so we're going to switch charisma and wisdom, maybe? That makes sense? Wisdom being the spellcasting yeah. modifier. Yeah, Totally. Great. And then, Six, do we want? Nine. Yeah. What do you think? Now, uh, we could switch constitution and dexterity or something like that. Um, Is it crazy to roll a d6 and add it to one of those sevens? Um, roll a d4. Okay. Right, because we we can't be too nice. 
<laughs> okay, let me get my mac and cheese dice out. Okay. So it's a 10. Oh, right. So wild shape will always replace your strength, dex, and con. So that you're usually probably good. You said, oh, of course. So wait, what'd you oh, say? What'd you just roll? A three. So that makes one of those sevens a 10. Let's make the dex a 10. Okay, cool. Because you're probably not going to use your just regular strength for a lot. Yeah, you're like a ghostly sh crow. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now Pearl's character. What What's this haunted crow's name? Edgar Allan Poe. The character's name is Edgar Allan Poe. Allie? <laughs> Edgar Allie Poe. <laughs> Edgar Allie Poe. Oh my god. Okay. Um Edgar Ali Oyama. <laughs> Edgar Ali Poyama? Oyama. <laughs> Edgar oh, Ali yeah. Crow. Edgar Ali Crow is better. Oh no. <laughs> Edgar Ali Crow Yama? Yeah, yep. Edgar Ali Crow. -yama. What are we doing? You can change this name, okay? You can change like you can older. change this name. If you're like hard pass, we'll just we'll figure yeah. you this is respectfully we would say you're wrong for changing the yeah. name. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. You are at liberty. Edgar <laughs> Alley Crow. <laughs> wait, I have to screenshot this. Oh wait, sorry, one second. Absolutely crazy. Well, you can screenshot the final product, right? Yeah. Um right. Druid starting equipment. They got a little wooden shield. That's funny to me. Uh, and a scimitar. <laughs> uh, their druidic focus is a druidic focus. Hmm. Or, I, I I don't know. A little U wand is funny. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's add them a cool item. Um, so this haunted bird is having a bad time. Pipes of haunting. What's that? Ooh. You can frighten people with your haunted pipe. Yeah. Ooh, right. Cool. Let's throw that in there. That's amazing. Well, the effects are last for twenty four hours. Ghost lantern. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, let's give him the ghost lantern. Of a mage hand spell. Ooh. Wow, that's pretty cool. That's pretty sick. This character, yeah, pretty sick. All right, I think that's good. All right, let's view the character sheet. Staff of Bird Calls is cool, but we've given it to so many people already. I feel like they it would be fun to give them something different. So, negative two strength, plus one to dex, plus four to con, zero intelligence, plus three to uh, wisdom, minus one charisma, 14 armor class, but a lot of this will change when you wild shape. You have these sick items. Uh, Edgar Alley Kroyama. <laughs> <laughs> I think they're done. I think this character is done. Oh, wait, did I not... I, I skipped something, right? Choose a background. I almost forgot. Um, I feel like they're like a ha the haunted one, right? Oh, we didn't pick one? Yeah, there's a, literally a background called haunted one. Yeah, so this is, yeah. So I think investigation's funny. Like they're a bit of a detective. Ooh. Yeah. Like a little Riz. And I love it. Survival makes sense. Choose an exotic language to know. Hmm. Undercommon. It's very dark sounding. Ooh. Or deep speech. Let's go undercommon. Yeah, languages are so hard. We, maybe we could leave that blank and let them pick an exotic language based on the You get setting. to choose your own exotic language. Yeah. Okay, great. A little bird riz. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put it in the Discord. Pearl, I hope you enjoy it. Edgar. Yeah. Allie.
Okroyama. <laughs> and, uh, oh, I'm going to try to find... Where is that drawing? Oh, wow. Uh, let's... This is the... If you Can you see the, the link? Uh, this is... Oh, is it in the chat? Or no, in the uh, Twitch. Sorry. Whoa, it zoomed in a lot. I don't know how to unzoom. Oh, oh, I see, I see. Oh, there we are. That's the drawing of our last character. Someone just did that. <gasps> the 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 sea uh, barbarian. Amazing. Isn't that incredible? Oh my God! Wow, who did that? Uh, I think Ali Mine is it Ali Mine? Cool. Oh my God, we love it. <laughs> And those eyes are bright red. And mine, sorry. <laughs> huh? Uh, I, it's and mine, not Allie mine. Oh, and mine. Fun. Okay, cool. I'm gonna hide my screen for a second. Why am I doing that? Take your email from uh, UCB. One um... second. <laughs> yeah. So our show's off on Monday, <laughs> which is understandable uh, and necessary. Um, Great. Oh, is that what it said? I haven't read it yet. Yeah, it was just, we had a show on Monday, but we were, I was texting people earlier, like, I don't think we can do a show Monday. Yeah. And uh, and then they emailed us saying, we don't have to. Yeah. Thankfully. Okay. So, next up, as we said earlier, is, it's, lo wait, did I get the order out of it? Okay, it's Lars of the Stars is next. Oh, great. It's Lars of the Stars. All right, Caroline is it's Lars of the Stars, right? Hi, it's me. I've already I've already played a cleric, barbarian, fighter, and human tiefling halfling. So other than that, go wild. Hell yes. Sweet. Human tiefling and halfling have been done. Let's okay. see. Let's see what else. Ooh, you want to go tabaxi a little tabaxi? Oh my, Zach, you're literally in my mind. I was tabaxi. totally tabaxi. A little spoiler alert, Kalina vibes. Ooh. Um, yeah, that's Tabaxi, hot. you get dexterity, charisma, feline agility, cat's claws, cat's talent, languages. You get to add a language. cat's talent? Cat's talent, you have proficiency in the profession, uh, perception and stealth skills. Oh, that's sick. Yeah, that's so, sick. uh, you get to know a language. Um, I think Minotaur. Um, it's <laughs> what I've been doing to everyone, uh, just throwing <laughs> Minotaur in there. Um, <laughs> let's choose a class. You get decks added to your thing, so that's kind of cool. Tabaxi, uh, you know, you go rogue. You can go. You want to make a gloom stalker? Oh my god! Right, that is cool. Um, uh, walk me through it. What do we do? We go in ranger first. Yeah. Um, level three. Ranger archetype. Gloom stalker. Okay, let's go level two, right? And then we do. Uh, and then we do one level of rogue to get the sneak attack. Very cool. Ooh! Ooh absolutely. Yes. Very powerful. Um, class features. So this character is just going to be badass. Yeah. Archer. It was so fun to play Gloomstalker with a, with a rogue level. It was insane. Mm -hmm. It is very badass. It's very badass. Uh... Where, where what is the place the underdark maybe i don't know you have to choose yeah. a place underdark, yeah, underdark maybe so. they're like in a dark underdark kind of they're they're in the same campaign as the kinku yeah uh animal handling maybe or uh, sorry let's see what proficiencies um investigation seems cool and insight and nature and oh, arguments for everything um this is howdy i'm just realizing this is my cat yeah 
So who's Howdy's favorite enemy? Uh, White <laughs> Cat. Band? It's White Cat. Uh, this white cat that shows up outside our window and stares at Howdy and no way they hate each other. Go to my Instagram uh, if you want to, and I'll, it, you'll see uh, saved to my page like a story where they have a confrontation. That's maybe my favorite piece of filmmaking I have ever done. Um, I think Howdy considers himself <gasps> insightful. Oh in touch God. with nature this cat and do you have the sound on by the way oh my god <laughs> <laughs> did you see that meme that was um uh get out and it was a person being like i would have posted two black squares if they had oh liked. my god <laughs> truthfully i'm one of those fucking idiots who put a black square with a hashtag black lives matter and, oh my God. and did it and then went to sleep and looked at my phone in the morning had all these people so rightfully mad at me just yeah. the worst feeling uh it sucks. you can't beat yourself up it's a learning yeah curve. truly yeah. great learning experience to not just sort of like be reactive instead be responsive about things totally yeah, yeah. uh but like no moving sucked. on uh, it just sucked, <laughs> uh, you know, but you can't let it slow you down. You got to keep going and learning. Uh, yeah. Favorite enemy. Favorite enemy of Howdy. White with cat. White cat, <laughs> barring that. So that means human in my head. Oh, cool. Yeah. You know what, though? I would say maybe leave it blank depending on their campaign. Yeah. Okay. Um, but... <laughs> like brennan when i was choosing my favorite enemy i thought he was gonna make me choose like a land you know in uh in the world and he just made it like all food <laughs> yeah <laughs> Which well, like incredible. it's it's a weird hamstringing factor for uh rangers um yeah. and i think that's a, a big reason why people are like i don't like rangers because it's like so specific yeah yeah oh i have to show people how they which is a reward um okay let's make sure proficiencies choose a rogue skill acrobatics seems right yeah expertise Ooh. acrobatics <laughs> mm. and uh thieves tools stealth 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 for sure yes you like already it. get pretty good stealth with okay i'm gonna leave I'm gonna leave for a second to grab Howdy, but uh, if you could, uh, we got, it's time to maybe roll some stats. So I'll be right back. Uh, oh, okay, oh, he cool. just walked in here. Cool. He, he knew he was being called. Um, okay, let me see. I need to get ready for, oh. for my big roll. Oh, time. <laughs> Ow. Yeah, shout out Peppermint Ow. Preston. Ow. You don't have to do that. We can stop. <laughs> Just clawing my face. Um, sorry. So. Oh let's... no, everyone thinks it was a spoiler. No, no, I quietly take a rogue level. Don't worry. <laughs> it's, it's like. Um, it's like tr truly not a spoiler. <laughs> it's not a spoiler, and I—it's already happened. Yeah. <laughs> I be—I changed the gloom stalker, and I really beefed it up. Yeah. <laughs> um. Okay, cool. So let's roll the stats. Did you roll them? Sorry, I wasn't. Oh I no! Sorry, sorry. I was—I was, I was catching worry. up on the chat. You know. You gotta check. We've hit twenty-four thousand. Oh shit. Time for a squat. Squat. Get that squat. Uh, okay, that is a 19. 15. 17. Holy shit. Let me write these down while you squat. Yes, my dudes. Thank you so much. Thanks to everyone for 24,000. Allie, you know what the, the start of this campaign was? How much money we were trying to raise? No, two thousand dollars, <gasps> and it happened immediately. And I was like, "Oh my god!" And we've Wait, just been, 
We've been pushing it back. Like, oh my god, it's been crazy. That's so crazy. Oh my god, and now you're at 24,069. Someone just nice. clearly just donated 69 cents, right? These rolls are on fire. Oh, wait, what, what have they been so far? I, I'm writing them down, don't worry. Okay. You're busy squatting. <laughs> uh, we got it. Okay, you ready? Yes. 19, Woo! 15, 17, 11, 15, 10. That's huge. And I That's have to, huge. the strength, I have to adjust, overwrite it to be 19. Okay, well, let's maybe, the strength in night as 19 is crazy. Yeah. We can switch that out with wisdom because wisdom is a, a ranger spell casting modifier. Or should we just go dex? That's kind of. Dex is pretty important for sure. Yeah. And then, oh, this was 15. Oh, I, I screwed this up. Uh, 12? Wait, what Wait, happened? Did we Zach, just get $1,000? You just got 1000 <laughs> What the fuck? That's fucking nuts. Thank you. You need to do it. Whoever anonymously spot. gave. All right. We'll see if I can do it. Oh my gosh. <sighs> wow. <sighs> Deeper. <Thank> you. <laughs> wow. Wow. You love to see it, folks. A thousand dollars from an anonymous donor. Uh, what? What is that? Thank you. Wild. Insane. Beautiful. Perfect. You gotta clap Beautiful. for that. That is incredible. Thank you so much. I gave my deepest squat yet for that. Truly terrible form, though. You know. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Uh, wow. You love to see it. Incredible. Incredible. Oh. I'm blown away. I screwed up these stats, but I think they're fine. Uh, I mean, they're all really good, yeah. Okay, great. Now, Howdy is an obvious choice for the name, but I don't oh, want to throw yeah. the, my cat's identity on this character. And, um, I think it is Howdy, though, unfortunately. Yeah, I think it is. Howdy Wilhelmina. <laughs> Howdy Wil. Holly Will Willamina. Sometimes for no reason, and I don't know where it came from at all, we call Howdy Rick Dawson. <laughs> what? So, Rick Dawson. Yeah. Love it. Character's name is Rick Dawson. <laughs> Phoebe <laughs> just <laughs> laughed at Kevin. Zach, I already made Howdy? Okay, then this is Rick Dawson. All right. I fully forgot. I've made we've made so many characters and we have so many more to go. <laughs> um, Rick Dawson Wilhelmina. Rick Dawson. That is so funny. Choose a background. Okay. Jesus. Um. That is so crazy. Man. I mean, it's like I've been really my eyes have been really open to the idea of like actively fundraising. You know, yeah. being on a live stream really, really, uh, for whatever reason, gets people motivated to donate. Yeah, totally. And it's been really exciting to see how generous people have been. I think we're all just really energized, too. Yeah, for sure. I do. Some of me wonders, like, you know, we're all quarantined and pretty isolated, and it just feels really good to reconnect. Yeah. And we've all already known that this is like necessary, but even like at marches and protests and stuff, there have been people everywhere passing out water and granola bars and yeah, hand sanitizer. like hand sanitizer. Like people are just like doing the work. It's so cool. Yeah, it's like yeah, we can absolutely take care of each other. You spend like 
20 bucks on your way to something and you pick up a whole bunch of snacks and water yeah. for everyone. Oh, Gorgeous. It's beautiful. It's so, really beautiful. So the background, I throw uh, anthropologists down. <laughs> <laughs> These stats are so good. We can afford to do something kind of yeah, true, interesting. True, true. I mean, yeah, this character already kicks. So out. now they're they're proficient in religion, and maybe we'll throw in deception. Oh, okay. That's kind of badass. What else is in here? Arcana, athletics, animal handling, performance, sleight of hand, persuasion. Um, let's say yeah. Let's just I don't know. It's deception. I like deception. Leaving these languages blank. I'll, we'll choose one for you. I think it's funny if a cat knows Dwarvish. <laughs> That's so cute. Uh, characteristics. Uh, this is another howdy type cat. So a beautiful little black cat. Yeah. Uh, skin, you can't really see it. Uh, so we're just going to... Eyes. Uh... What color eye? Can you put cow for skin? Sorry, what? That's my favorite thing ever when you're petting a dog or a cat and you realize their skin is like like a cow, like little. What? Does that ever happen to you? It's like, I, I couldn't see you when you were talking. Uh, it's like a little cow. <laughs> you know, like it's cow print. You realize you have, that their it's... skin is like black and white, you know, kind of like spots. Oh, yeah, yeah. You ever you ever see just like the leg of a dog and you're like, oh my god, cute. That's a cow. That's, That's a cow. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. I simply need to find a photo. Allie, we got to come up with some eye colors. Um, how about one blue and one green? Yeah. Or something like, I don't know. I love that. That's really cool. Height. Um, probably three feet tall when they're on all fours. And uh, five, five, seven. <laughs> Otherwise, they're cats, so they're about like 80 pounds. They're live. That's two uh, inches shorter than me. So. Okay, that's too light then. Uh, let's go like, I don't know, 140 pounds. Uh, they're thick, you know. Uh, age. Let's go uh, tw 20 again. Gender. Leave me a blank. Cat. <laughs> Cat. I think leather armor over scale mail, right? Um, that makes sense. Two short swords sounds cool. Explorer's <laughs> pack sounds cool. Now let's, let's add that and give a, a, a magical item. I loved having a bow. I oh, loved yes. A sick bow. Yeah. Now, I always, like, am annoyed by having to search for bows in this game. Um, oh, yeah, what would it be? Crossbow? A crossbow. Hmm. A vicious hand crossbow. Whoa. Oh, hellfire crossbow. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Let's do one of those. Oh, that's pretty cool, too. Any humanoid killed by this has their soul funneled to the river Styx. It's just badass. We gotta, we just kind of have to. Wow. This tabaxi with a crossbow that takes your soul away? What <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. I think we got it. Yeah, incredible. This is Rick Dawson, Wilhelmina. They're a tabaxi ranger rogue. Uh, see you, Orc Bill. This is so sick. This is just a sick character. Um, great. Uh, it, so that was um, Caroline? Or uh, who is it? Lars of the Stars? We're at sixty nine sixty nine right now. Incredible. Two th well, twenty five thousand dollars in sixty nine sixty nine. Lex is awesome. Awesome sauce four three two. Please roast their handle. <laughs> <laughs> hey, sometimes you don't even have to. Uh, <laughs> just kidding. It's great. Um, 
Click to download. All right, here we are. Rick Dawson, Wilhelmina, White Cat cameo? Sorry, I saw that in Discord and I thought someone had seen White Cat out my window. Got oh, scared. that would be amazing. Um, so, okay. I have to give Allie a gnome in Animal Crossing. I think we'll have to do Animal Crossing another time. I think we just have to knock this stuff out. Oh my out. gosh, yeah, I can't wait. I mean, honestly, Zach, I kind of got nothing for time, and this <laughs> fundraising is in doing incredible numbers, so. I mean, it's been really the numbers. The numbers. They're just incredible. We do a few rounds. This can be one of three. Uh-oh, we got to fix it again. <laughs> Gustav, sorry. <laughs> Appreciate the $32. And 99 cents and then anonymous screwed it up with 2001 <laughs> we just got to keep that train running yeah um, Ooh, who wants to know if i have aquarius placements aquarius wow, i just simply love your chat i love it's a beautiful chat you'll it's a great I hang feel like i belong here and yes i do have aquarius placements you you got me what are placements so it's kind of like you have your main sign but then you have signs it's it's like a snapshot of the sky when you were born and based uh, on where the planets and stuff are you have different placements hell yeah hell yeah um i would love to see your chart zach my chart i'll tell you when i my birthday august 22nd so i'm I on leo it. cusp um i think i was born around 10 p.m wow i don't know you know what? I'm going to do all this because Brennan actually sent me his full chart, which blew my fucking mind. And he told me not to tell anyone about it. And maybe he'll release it one day. Ah, <laughs> that is so funny. You do the same with yours because, honey, it's juicy. Okay. Well, I won't reveal. I feel like I've revealed a lot, but I won't reveal <laughs> anymore. <laughs> yeah, funny. Um, cool. So next up is Awesome Sauce in the chat uh for the zesbians uh requesting the most chaotic spellcaster possible for my character playability options option playability optional lesbianess required incredible uh let's get started on that i'm thinking wild magic sorcerer right yeah <gasps> um, but what's the race oh let's do a, a snake person right Oh my god, what is that called? A Yonti pureblood. A serpent creature known as the Yonti. I mean, regardless of what it's called, I think it's fun to be a snake person. Yeah, that's fun. Wild magic snake person is insane. Um, okay, they got charisma. So that lines up with sorcerers. Uh, dark innate spell casting. You know, you know the poison spray cantrip already before a clap. <laughs> Advantage on magical, uh, on saving throws against spells and other magical effects. Poison immunity. You can speak, read, and write common, abyssal, and draconic. Sick, absolutely sick. Let's go. Let's go. Sorry, the chat became about astrology, but I'm going to read it later. Oh, it's so tempting. <laughs> well, yeah, let's focus. All right. Proficiencies. We got we got to choose from Arcana, Deception, Insight, Intimidation, Persuasion, and Religion. Okay. What's chaotic? Deception's chaotic. Yes. Uh, intimidation's pretty chaotic. Yep. Uh, Spellcasting. We, we go wild magic, right? Yeah, definitely. Wild magic Woo! serves tides of chaos. And wild magic is a pretty, like, open to homebrew rules, yeah. I would say. Because if you're just going by, like, what's written, it's, like, blue feathers and stuff like that. And then with Brennan, we decided we would put, like, juicier things on the table. Ooh, I love it. Pick up to 100. Hell yeah. So just come up with 100 juicy things. Yeah. One of them was TPK, though, so I do recommend... One of them was? Oh. One, one of the roles was TPK in Unsleeping City, yeah. That is so insane. Yeah, unfortunately. I didn't even know that. You heard it here first. 
That deserves some donations, right? Yeah. <laughs> Just selling, like hawking. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> TMZ for D twenty. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so what is more chaotic? Probably empowered spell, right? Yeah. Uh, it does more damage, and then twin spell to double the or quicken spell, so you're doing more spells. Oh shit. I don't know. Do you have any That's strong cool. feelings? No, no, I love that. Because careful is not chaotic, right? Careful spell or whatever. Careful is not chaotic. Quicken would be, especially uh, Brennan, like, kind of made it so that any time I cast anything, I had to do a, mi a wild magic uh -huh. check. So if Ooh. you're using Quicken, that's even more wild magic checks. That's... Allie... Cool. I'm, get, I'm getting requests that at a certain milestone, cash-wise, we show my chart. And now I don't have it, but uh, I can work with oh, you. Oh, I could to get it for it you out. in like one second. Okay. Wait, I kind of I need to know how juicy it is. Okay. Okay, so I will text you stuff, and I say if we hit twenty-seven thousand dollars, I'll show it. I'll come back on the stream and we'll show it. Yeah. Uh, and at twenty six thousand nine hundred sixty nine dollars and sixty nine cents, I'll show it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, tw okay. So we'll just know that that's ready. Great. Love it. Um. Okay, great. So let's keep going on with this ability score time. Let's add some chaos. Let's do it. So first off is strength. Uh, Allie, do you want to roll or? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got an eleven. Okay. We got a fifteen. Okay. Got a seventeen. Sixteen. Holy shit! Come on. Bro. Allie, this is ridiculous. Ten. Three. Oh no! <laughs> okay, so add that D four, right? To the three, you think? Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Okay. One. So one. That becomes a four. Okay, so we're gonna switch that out with something else. You don't need fifteen decks. Um, so this is fifteen, and this becomes three. So actually, four now? Four. Sheesh. Pretty bad decks, but other than that, um, a very It's good... kind of nice to have one. One bad. One stat. bad one. Yeah. How much, How? what is dex, the decks of Kristen Applebee's? Oh, bad. Oh, <laughs> it's really bad. <laughs> and what is this chaotic snake? Decks. What is this chaotic snake? lesbian's name um oh, look i mean obviously it has to start with an s S sandra sandra <laughs> sandra lynn um <laughs> Sa samantha Samantha from Sex in the City. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Um, I'm going to write that down as a placeholder. Right. S Samantha <laughs> from Sex in the Zach, your city. chat is addictive. I cannot get away from it. <laughs> I'm trying to focus, okay? Just know that. Samantha from Sex in the City. Um Okay, I'm back. Sam. I like Sam. I like what it is right now and that they can know that it's Sam. <laughs> the character's name is Sam. All right, let's choose a background. Um I'm going to go Outlanders. Well, yeah, let's just pick one. Outlander. You grew in the wilds, so that's like part of it why it's like, you know, you don't get, you're chaotic. Yeah. I think they play a sham. That's their musical instrument. 
Cool. And languages, you know, we'll leave it up to them. Yeah. Starting equipment. You can see a snake with a crossbow very easily. Focus. <laughs> they have a, a crazy looking orb. Oh yeah, that's great. Explorers pack. Um, I'm just trying to, to be honest, uh, while respecting the character creation process, I am also trying to pick up the pace slightly. So yeah, no, no please, problem. I'm going to get to this stuff. It's okay. It's like, yeah, we should right. Really focus on the magical item. We the... should really focus on the, the top of character. creation. Yeah. Uh, filter. Why? Oh, uh, so per, uh, magic item. What's this Nate got? I want to say, um, staff of power. Palette? Oh yeah, great. This is the the staff that Mavris has uh on Nadpod. The coolest thing you can do is this retro uh, retributive strike. You can break your staff over your knee and then you have a 50% chance to basically die, but uh you can do like 350 damage. <gasps> um it's very it's very chaotic. Oh my god, that's so like Voltorb. <laughs> 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 classic Voltorb, baby. Yeah. Classic Voltorb. Classic electric. Hold on. I have to. Wow. Yes. Samantha. Samantha. It also like makes your de like your armor class go up. Oh shit. Um, but the armor class is still nine. <laughs> um it also has a bunch of spells within it whoa yeah that looked like a whole, i love it when they're just like all different abilities you know what people have mentioned snake serpent items i think i kind of have to go back and look oh, great. add items serpent robe of serpents whoa yeah we're gonna add it. Do you ever listen to Serpent with Feet? Serpent with Feet. No, I'm not sure I have. Great. Let's view this character sheet. Samantha from Sex in the City. Zero strength. I love the C to a bunch of S's. <laughs> <laughs> That's what people mean when they say CSS or C++. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, negative three to initiative. But some really chonky spells. Um, spells wise, they got all this stuff. They got Kona Cold, Fireball, Hold Monster, Lightning Bolt, Wall of Force. All that's in their staff. They haven't Incredible. even chosen spells yet. Exporting it to PDF or clicking to download. Samantha, aka Sam. Oh, yeah. Ooh, is that already Sam? Okay, here we go. Wow, look at this. <laughs> look at that. Wait, what? That's the character. If you are looking at. My oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Beautiful. Oh, I love her. Beautiful. I hope you like it. Uh, awesome sauce. It's pretty sick. It feels pretty crazy. Yeah, that's my a child. Really sick. I honestly want to play that character. Oh, I love it. Um, behind the screen. Uh, I I have to use the restroom real fast, but then we'll get started and we'll keep going. Love it. Um, okay, one second. Who do we have next? Does anyone know? Off, um, any of my friends helping me with the... Is it... Next would be... Can I Liam? Yay! Great. We're knocking them out. Okay, sorry, uh, one second. Yeah. I'm going to use the restroom. I'll be right back. Allie's going to talk about astrology, I think. I'm, I'm just going to only talk about uh, <laughs> your personal placements. What? Wait, send me your birth time in, in city. And you need the exact birth time. Good God. All right, how's everybody doing? Oh, Sappho, what the fuck? Oh, we completely missed that. Snappo, okay, goddammit. 
So instead, we did go for a 10 years late Sex in the City reference. We are, we do apologize. Um. <laughs> oh my gosh, we love it. I love it here. When I'm here, I'm family. <laughs> oh my God, I would love to drop Brennan's birthright. I'm sorry, this, it's so annoying to hear how good it is and not be able to see it, but let's just say it's caliente. Uh, <laughs> um, let me see. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Why well, I'm a Aquarius rising. That's where my Aquarius is. Shout out. <laughs> I drop. We dropped the entire cast birth chart. Oh, that'd be incredible. Oh, so funny. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Yeah. I'll leak it. Hello, hello. Hello. That's so funny. All right, can can Liam, did you have any um any specific hopes and dreams for your character? Let's see. Time to dab, Zach. I'm the D20 Zodiac whistleblower. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> oh, man. I'm here to blow the whistle on Brennan's chart. Let's be honest. Oh, shit. That. Oh, shit. Okay. Um, so who's next? We got Canna Liam. Oh, you put your stuff in the sheet because you're the editor. Yeah, great. Um... Wahoo! If possible, I would love an alley character, no qualifications other than would love for an arcane caster and for her to be fucking insane. Tenth level, that never comes into play preferred. <laughs> Thanks, love y'all, BLM. Also, P uh, please make her lesbian, that is all. Okay. Great. We love it. We love to see it. Arcane caster. Get out of this. Arcane caster. Now, We've been doing a thing where a few times we just like throw 10 levels of a character into a thing that just doesn't come into play. Um, so what race are we thinking? Okay. I mean, I was really loving Tabaxi, to be honest, but I don't know if that's boring to do two in a row. Well, we did a different one just now, right? Yeah. We did a Tiefling. Oh, oh yeah. We haven't done a tiefling in a second. That That's seems fun. fun. Yeah. Uh feral tiefling. Wait. Let's not do that one. Straight up tiefling. Um Here we are. We got um what do we need? We need, we got arcane casters would be like a sorcerer or a wizard. Um, was there any like, I, sorry, I think I missed the, what they don't want or what they usually play. Or did okay. they not write any of that? So they wanted an arcane caster. Uh, oh, okay, cool, cool. And then they also said, it'd be fun to have 10 levels of a thing that doesn't come into play, which is the thing I was doing previously. So maybe it makes more sense to just show you rather than. Okay, okay. Yeah. Um, I think it's... We haven't made a wizard yet. Oh, uh, cool, yeah. Let's and so I was thinking it'd be cool to be... I, this is a class that I want to play soon. Um, a blade singer. Restriction elves only. Who cares? Uh, so it's like you can add your intelligence um, and like use your swords and like it, it goes to your like decks and stuff. Um, incredible it and your armor class i mean it's very sick it's just very sick Blades elves sick. only but no we're just not gonna why would that ever be okay <laughs> 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 uh 
what kind of weapon do they want? We got this whole I mean, drop. blade, obviously. Yeah. Do we do a long sword? Yeah, just the biggest. What a broads? Is that crazy? A broad sword. I want. It. It's not in this drop down menu. Maybe it won't let a wizard hold a broad like a big. Um, let's say long sword for now. Maybe we can change something up later. It would be so fun to watch you play this. I really want to. That's I think really it'd be fun. Cool. But also, who knows? I'm oh. always so jealous when people have like a really fucking cool like a battle master was so sick. Yeah. Those are I mean I, I you know, there's so many cool different characters and, and when you play with other people who have like invested time in their character like, "Oh, that's why that character is cool." <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, I just it's crazy like when you don't know what you don't know, like when you're pretty new to something. Uh. -huh. You're just I just didn't I was like, oh, I'm pretty sure I get it now. And then you like open up a door and you're like, oh my God, there's so many options. Uh, okay. Which is great. Yeah. Um, I, I said Arcana Investigation for. Yeah, yeah, I love it. Those are it cool. Great. And then uh, we're going to add 10 levels of a class that doesn't come into play at all. Uh, we're going to make you a 10th level monk. <laughs> <laughs> uh but that will never come into play oh my god <laughs> sorry okay, class features crazy. you know you're a drunken master monk you don't drink anymore this is why it doesn't come into play oh my god a sober drunken master monk uh you incredible dual wielder and i instead of ability score improvements i just do feats over and over again um <laughs> you're a tavern brawler <laughs> uh i think that's it great 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 beautiful um let's let's get some ability scores going yeah all right Nine. does anybody know how many characters we've done so far today so this is four or five Four or five, right? We got two nines. Two nines. Nineteen. Sixteen. Nineteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eleven. Okay. Got it. Sick. So I'm gonna oh, make. Oh, it's a nineteen actually. Instead yeah, it does this weird thing where like it automatically makes it eighteen because I guess you're not supposed to have that. Uh, but I'm going to switch it with Dex. Oh, great. This will be 18. This is 9. And then and then override that to make it 19. And then intelligence should be 17. Yeah. Agreed. Because you're a wizard. You're a wizard, Harry. Um, so we have the name. Uh... <laughs> This lesbian's name is Harry. That's cute. Harry. Um, With an I. H-A-R-I. Harry. Oh, it's actually <laughs> cute. Or for Harry. Harry. Cute. Uh, Harry it the spy. Um, <laughs> yeah. What is Harriot? E-T-H-A. And then spy last name. <laughs> Does this make sense? Yeah, great. Yeah, an A in there. Yeah, perfect. Or an E. Yeah. Uh, okay. At the spy. <laughs> so uh -huh. background, background spy. <laughs> you absolutely love to see it. I loved that movie. Used to be a TV show too, or was it always just a movie? I, I think I, I, I totally... think the kid was in Pete and Pete. That's why I think it was a TV show. Oh yeah. yeah. All I remember is seeing it when I was really really young and naming my guinea pig Sport because of it. <laughs> <laughs> it was a book first. Um, I gave him a dice set. Feels fun. They got a criminal contact. 
that's sick. Okay, so let's some character details. Choose alignment. It would be really fun to have a character that plays D and D. They keep looking over their shoulder at the camera. <laughs> um, let's see. Let's see. What do we got? Choose an alignment. Uh, chaotic good. <laughs> They're all chaotic good. I mean, that's the most fun. Yeah, true. Faith. Um, hmm. Let's see. What makes sense faith-wise? Could be any. Um, sleuth. They... Faith in sleuthing? Yes. Harriet the Spy was a book first. <laughs> no, no, I'm just kidding. Faith in sleuthing is great. Faith in sleuthing. Harriet the Spy was a book first. <laughs> Lifestyle. They're, they're, they're modest. Hair. What does this person look like? This tiefling. They got probably like a colorful skin. Mm hmm. What color hair, though? What do you think? What's. What kind of. What's... Red skin, black hair. Is that yeah. too on the nose? It's a little on the nose, but that's cool. We can do white hair. Oh, wow. Cool. I love that. Eyes. Um... Red. Red on red might be weird. Oh yeah, and white white hair. It's very candy cane. Yeah. On the neck up. Um eyes. Let's do green. Yeah, cool. Very Christmas. Height, normal. <laughs> Wait, whatever. Yeah, great. Um uh, age. This is a prodigy. This is a sixteen year old. Hell yeah. Gender open. Love it. Okay. Equipment. Magical item. Oh wait, am I skipping ahead? Oh, um, slightly, but not really. Uh, choose. Their arcane focus is a wand. Fun. That's kind of fun. Uh, scholars pack, cause they're a wizard. Add item. What happens if you give them a great sword? Moon touch great sword. I don't know if they'll be able to wield it. What happens to this? Oh yeah, I forget that they're sober at 16. <laughs> hey, that's some people. Yeah. Mm, does this make sense? Can we even use a great sword? We're just home ruling that you can. I think a moon touch greatsword sounds cool. I was looking at that. Yeah, what is that? What is that? In darkness, an unsheathed blade of the short sword sheds moonlight. Fifteen. Yeah, it just kind of glows. Okay. Okay. Or do we what's just go sword? What's the sword under it? Do you just go crazier? Uh, great oh, sword of what vengeance. What the fuck is a mind blade? Ooh, where is that? It's down a little bit. Mind? About halfway down. It's. In the blue. Oh, mind blade. Mind flares can turn an, any non-magical sword into a mind blade. Oh, okay. His extra, oh, remember Catelyn Whitclaw from the Le Leviathan? He kind of had one of these. Oh. So maybe we just make one for this person. Yeah, sick. I think that's sick. 2d6 slashing damage. That's pretty cool. And you're attuned to the mind player. Can you? Oh, yeah. Great. Inventory. Give him some kind of cool robe. Cool. Um. Oh, I want to give I, another, like, gay power. Hmm. Um. Okay. Knowing glance as well. Knowing they also have knowing glance. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then the robe of the arch magi. That's a pretty good item. Whoa! What does that do? Oh, it does a lot. 
it gives you, it makes your uh, armor class is 15 plus your dex modifier. Uh, you have advantage on saving throws against spells. Your spell save DC and spell attack bonus increased by two. So that's huge. That is so cool. Oh my god, wait, I love this website. This is crazy. Yeah, it's so helpful to go through stuff like this. I mean, yeah, it's just been such a, like, access blocker to have to get all the books and stuff. Yeah. And so the, and I'm just, trying to create a character right now, and I can't... Yeah. yeah I love looking at all these, like... Well, we I, have these accounts, yeah. Yeah, yeah so sick. Um, Very at the spy. <laughs> the armor class is 19. <laughs> Uh, and then when you do a, a blade song, you, your armor class becomes 23. It's Incredible. Pretty, pretty sick. Very cool. Um, great, great, great. This is, um, I think Harry at the Spy is overpowered. <laughs> yeah, with that sword. And that cloak. It's insane. Um, Canalium. I hope you enjoy Harry at the Spy. <laughs> Holy shit. <sighs> oh, we already got a picture. Was... Let's look at this. Harry at the Spy and their giant sword. <laughs> <laughs> you love to see it. Incredible. Oh my gosh. Oh, I so we've, can't. have we done five? Is that correct? Um, you're Colleen. We're finally back to Colleen. Great. Woo. -hoo. Um, great, great, great. Uh, oh shoot. Where is it? Just like to, uh, a fay um lesbian with some sort of chaotic alignment and i was going to say wild magic but lex beat me to it so ali please choose uh colin wants ali to know if she loves them very much Aww. i gotcha okay uh sorry one sec let me so let's think about it yeah let's think of something fucking cool so far we haven't been thinking of cool stuff. <laughs> no, no, they've all been so cool. We have to keep I'm up. I'm joshing. I'm freaking joshing. <laughs> worm raid. Who's worm? Worm raids. Worm raids happening. Hello. Oh, oh wormwood gaming. Nice thing, right? Oh yeah, yeah. They make the. I, I know wormwood quite well. Do you have yours, Allie? No, Lou has. Oh yeah, all Lou has it. yours. Oh well, hello, hi everyone, thanks for joining. If you're new, we are um, making D and D characters for uh, for donations uh, for uh, for the bail project, and this is something we started. I started doing on Monday. And over the course of the week, I've made um, not enough characters. We have about 70 backlogged, uh, but we've made a bunch. And um, Allie's helping me out uh, do that today. And it's been really fun. Um, so thanks for joining. And if you are so inclined, uh, we got, you know, a donation link below. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah jube jello um if you donated a t some total of a hundred sure you'll, we'll put you on the list we're gonna close the list off on sunday just because i will be doing this for the rest of my life it seems like <laughs> uh but we'll we'll have opportunities in the future for things like this uh but i just kind of have to like restructure it a little bit um lou has ali's uh uh oh, warm yeah. with thing because when we were doing our first quarantine stream, uh, it accidentally got delivered to Luz. Um, yeah, we got all of our stuff delivered to us and like wiped down and all that. Yeah. And I looked in mine and there were two empty chess X boxes. Oh no. <laughs> Zero dice in them. <laughs> Horrible. Uh, so and that's why so we let's... have the mac and cheese 100 <laughs> that I had to go and get. <laughs> so cheesy dangerously cheesy i would i would argue they're dangerously cheesy yeah okay let's get let's started colleen. colleen's character hell yeah 
Okay, let me read the thing again. Uh, it's... Um, let's see, let's see. Colleen, I forget where your, your thing went. Uh, uh oh, okay. So chaotic alignment, some kind of fey lesbian. Uh, Incredible. So not wild, necessarily wild magic sorcerer, but um, do you still want it to be a, a caster or something? So uh, fey makes me think of elf, and yeah. we will go. I mean, what elf is kind of cool? You know, I kind of wouldn't it be cool to do kind of like a prep school, almost like a gay adine. Yeah. Like an incredibly preppy but chaotic lesbian. All girls school chaotic elf. There we go. We got the Fey ancestry. <laughs> yeah. Colleen, what did we make you last time so I don't make the same class? Um Someone's I'm gonna someone said a ladron, and that sounds cool. Ooh, yeah. Fun. Look at that. Very cool. It's very uh, fey. Um, we love it. We love to see it. You love to see it. Hmm. <laughs> oh, let me tell you. I know Adine isn't gay. <laughs> <laughs> Those are the unseen uh, scenes from Fantasy High. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay, so Paladin was what we made, I think, last time, right? Um, so let's look at a different caster kind of vibe. Um, let's go Warlock. <laughs> I don't know. There's some chaotic uh, Warlock vibes. Oh, I'm saying Adine's clearly ace. <laughs> um... Okay. Wait, yeah. hold on. Back to the task at hand. Wait, let's... I think you wanted... I'm going to actually get rid of Warlock and go Sorcerer, but we'll just go a different kind of Sorcerer. It seems like you wanted Sorcerer. Um, okay, level 3 Sorcerer. Proficiencies. Um, let's go Persuasion. That feels chaotic. Deception also feels chaotic. Sorcerer's Origins. Wild magic would be, you know, Pete-ish. Draconic bloodline's fun. We did a shadow magic one earlier. Storm sorcery one. Have we done a storm sorcerer today? We did the storm uh, we barbarian. Did, we did storm barbarian, but we haven't done storm sorcerer. Hell yeah. Let's do that. Um, cool. Incredible. So we got that going. We're looking at this now. Uh... Where you you got all this tempest tempestuous magic, uh, <laughs> you got a bonus action where you can whirl gusts of elemental air to surround you. Oh, incredible! That's um, so sneaky. Yeah, you can just fly up ten feet without provoking opportunity attacks. Great. He's incredible. Now the meta magic. Um, again, chaos. Mm -hmm. Let's go. You know, quicken spell is always chaotic. Yeah. Heighten spell. What does that do? I forget. They all kind of sound the same. <laughs> what are the other options? Quicken, heighten. Careful, distant, empowered. Empowered's pretty chaotic. Oh, cool. Twin spell's cool because it makes you cast two spell. You can cast two of the same spells at once. That's really cool. Um, Zach, please confirm what? I don't know. Please confirm what? Is Gorga bisexual? <laughs> <laughs> I, I guess, honestly, I shouldn't go on record and say Adine is ace. That's Siobhan's journey. Uh, <laughs> yeah. This is just me. Uh, this is just me popping off, you know? <laughs> you know, I have to be honest. I honestly don't think he is. I think Gorga's just... Uh, a straight uh half work <laughs> yeah that's okay yeah you know it's it's just the truth unfortunately yeah, I, I, some people are different and that's okay gorgug straight <laughs> yeah that's just what he is he's born that way 
Apologies. I just, it's just the way the Gorga. You know what? <laughs> it works. Uh, he did okay. kiss Rog. True. Um, oh, that was, I forgot about that. <laughs> Honey, you love to see it. If we get to 30,000. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> You'll kiss Trap. I'll kiss Trap, yeah. <laughs> um, let's roll some ability scores. All right, yeah, let's get it. Okay. We got a three, a hot three. Sorry. Hot three, oh. out the gate. 15. 15. 15 again. 15. 16. 16. Five. And... 12. 12, okay. So right should out I... the gate, I think we should tra switch intelligence and charisma. You wanna add something to that three? Yeah, if you wanna roll a d4 for that. Sounded fun. Where do you think it went? In your drink? In your yeah. coffee? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, it was empty, so we're good. Pink. Okay. It's a little bit of coffee. It's two. Okay. Five strength. It's okay. You're a caster. You don't need strength. You don't need strength. Also... Don't really need wisdom. Yeah. You want to roll a d4 for that wisdom? Yeah. Your top of your class in your like school uniform and you're not very strong yeah you can just fly without opportunity attacks that's <laughs> incredible um did you roll a d4 for the wisdom sorry oh oh great call okay cool cool get away it's a four okay so wisdom becomes nine Love great it. some pretty good stats across the board yeah calling character character what is their name this fae, oh, lesbian, cool. sorcerer. Um, let me see. You know, I love Amisha. Ooh. I'm pretty much exclusively basing this character off of that oh. one lesbian movie about private school girls where Misha Barton is in it. Oh my God, Misha Barton. Or maybe Misha Barton. <laughs> Now, how, how can we slightly change this name to make it, uh, what's Barton? Let's change Barton up slightly, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, Bart. Let's see. Ooh, But I'm a Cheerleader is also a great movie, but this isn't the one. Ooh, that's funny. Misha of House Barton. Misha of House Barton! You love to see it. Hold on, let me find the name of this. I feel like it's, oh, is it Lost and Delirious? All these like early lesbian titles are unreal. It's like Lost and Delirious. Okay, let's, let's calm down. Can Gorga be bi for Pride Month? Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> and you can just decide. Yeah, why not? <laughs> Honey. Oh, wow. Misha Barton's 34. Who knew? 34? That's honestly, when people are, are, are famous so young, you just kind of like, what? That yeah. seems too young. Yeah. I've known yeah. of that person for 20 years. Yeah, totally. Uh, background. Um, I don't know. What's it kind of? Wait, Misha Barton was in the sixth sense? Yes. They're the kid that throws up the little like ghost kid that's throwing up and it's like their mom poisoned oh them. God, crazy. Oh, Much it is Lost and Delirious. Hmm. Uh, wow. Oh, honey, this is a photo that, how do I put something in the chat? Um, uh, it's kind of complicated. Well, it may not let you post it in the chat, but what if you sent it to, we'll send it to you. text it to me maybe I can just, Throw it into the Discord. Great. Okay, for another time. Um, let me. Yeah, we'll we'll figure it out later. Okay, Barton uh is a cloistered student, right? Yeah. Cloistered scholar, because they're just you know they know about history, arcana, nature, and religion. Uh, which one of those arcana, nature, or religion is you know popping out? I would say, in my mind, religion, if it's like a school thing, like a yeah. Catholic school thing. 
Oh my god, love it. Yes. Uh, Absolutely in Catholic school. We'll leave the languages up to you. Physical characteristics. Um, they look like Misha Barton, right? Yeah. Brown hair. White skin. Uh, eyes. What color are her eyes? Probably like blue. Uh, huh? Blue. Brown? I don't know. Height. Whatever Misha Barton's height is. These are just Misha Barton's stats. Yeah. School, school kid, um, 16? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, 16. Uh, all right, equipment. Any simple weapon. I think they have a quarter staff. This is, we're gonna give them a cool item, so this kind of doesn't matter. Okay. How on earth do you do this, Zach? I feel like I could, I can either focus on the chat or I can focus on what we're doing. <laughs> I'm really kind of ignoring the chat while we do it. All right, yeah, yeah. we have work to do. We have yeah. Work. Okay. Uh, it's it's unfortunate, but it's impossible to just. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Here we are. Here we are. Now we add a, a cool item. Let's say, is there like a spell blade? Love that. Like this is a very funny email with no subject line and it's just a photo of Misha Barton with another girl in their Catholic school uniforms. Truly, uh, I'm gonna report you. I feel so uncomfortable just posting that. <laughs> it's not. It's truly just them, like in the cafeteria. Yeah. Oh, I mean, there are some steamy screenshots I could have sent you from that movie. Um. Okay. All right. Let's go here. Or whoever wants it. Per alley. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't me this is this this is uh zach just sharing photos off of his desktop <laughs> i just truly a bad bit <laughs> uh all right let's find a uh you know what would be kind of cool okay wait yeah she is is there some sort of magical pen item or like a journal or something like that? A scribe's pen. You can use this pen to write on any surface. That's any pen. <laughs> <laughs> You're describing a Sharpie. Uh, and you can make it visible or invisible. So that's also- well, that's, Oh, that's really hot. That's so, you could write like a little love note and no one else can see it. Uh, necklace. Let's look for like a necklace. Oh, fun. Um, necklace of adaptation. You can breathe in any environment, such as cloud kill or stink, stinking cloud. If you, you have advantage on saving throws and those things. That's okay. Let's go, let's look for some wands. Wand of the War Mage sounds cool. Yeah. What is it? Plus two to bon a bonus and to spell attack rolls. It's gonna be, it's gonna be good. You ignore half cover. It's pretty cool. Just adding it, just to add it. Um, and let's let's think of one more. <laughs> Magic item. What's a ring? Maybe like a ring of endless light. <laughs> Is that a type of ring? Did you just make that, that That's up? the Disney movie that Misha Barton was <laughs> <laughs> Ring of endless light. Is there it's, uh, She for sure has the pen, right? That's yes. a non ghost. Is the OC in here? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ring of free... Ring of protection? 
Oh. It's a promise ring. Literally. Yeah. Oh my God. It's a promise <laughs> ring that also brings up what? Birth control. The Nuba ring. Okay. Oh my God. Okay. I think we got some good stuff in here. I'm reading this insane book. This is such a tangent, but it, it's talking about like birth control and like just pretty much like all the pharmaceutical like how pharmaceuticals has kind of made sex not just for procreation and like mm. how you know that's the main argument from like the right about like gay shit it's crazy and i found out i was born the year that viagra came on the market and birth control like some sort of crazy year where all of them came out at the same time and that was the year i was born wow <laughs> Hey, look, look, I, I have to send this to, oh my God. What? Uh, can you see that? Someone drew Harriet already. Do you see it? <gasps> oh my God. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. Very, that very, really, really very, cool. very sick. Um, that is so cool. Wow. Wamber. Incredible job. So many talented artists in the community. That's so, uh, such a gift. Incredible. Um, okay. So uh, this is Misha of House Barton. Minus three strength. Plus three dex. Plus two constitution. Plus one intelligence. Minus three. Minus one wisdom. Plus three charisma. This is a sorcerer. A storm sorcerer, I think. Um, they got two weapon fighting. Um, forget why they have that. Face step. You can use uh, you once per short rest as a bonus action. You can magically teleport up to thirty feet. Um, face step is good. Wow, that is so sick. That's just a, a oh, once a per bonus sh action? a bonus action, and it's once per short rest, and it's oh not a spell God. slot. Wow, very, that is so sick. very good. Um. And obviously, knowing glance. I mean, knowing glance is, of course, for the, basically all the characters we've made in the last little bit. Wow. Um, I'm gonna add it to the the thing. Um, wait, sorry. Nisha. Nisha of House Barton. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, and we got a a little. We got a pick of Misha. <laughs> Oh gosh, every mi character made today has knowing glance. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> um, I think this is, you know, I think we did the dent of uh, people who requested Allie for a character. Uh, going forward, I'll pr I may or may not have some buds come in to um, to help out with characters going forward as we try to knock these out. This is. Oh, Misha and Harry. Oh, that's so cute. Aw. Uh, they meet each other and they hate each other. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Then, then they respect each other. <laughs> and then they marry for life. <laughs> wow. Wow. Incredible. We here. Someone make the graphic novel. Um, I think we're going to stop there, right? It seems okay, like yeah, a good cool. stopping point. Um, I'm just going to read some donations for a little bit. Uh, Ali, uh, please chill um and uh really if you need chill. to get out of here uh pl you know thank you so much for joining yeah, nothing but time i've started to go to night protest because the curfew has gone so <laughs> nice nice i got um, the whole day honey. greek word thanks for the bits uh pride 100 yeah S sumira thanks for the 20 dollars uh anonymous thanks for the 20 dollars uh evil queen's rule thanks for gifting a sub to twitch that was so crazy. I've never seen that. that so crazy. The whole of the whole website Twitch. Twitch was here. <laughs> um, I can't believe that. Rachel Larius, thanks for the five subs. Uh, Winty Fresh, thanks for the hundred dollars to Tiltify. Uh, uh, Anonymous, thanks for the thirty dollars. Uh, the Zisexuals are here to say Black Lives Matter and ACAB. Hell yeah. Uh, R R P K B, thanks for the hundred dollars to the um, donation. Uh, You'd like the idea of a grung who rides on a giant frog, like a mounted knight, who is just some frog. <laughs> very cool. That was like, there's a, a Chrono Trigger is a very cool game that you would probably like one of the characters for. Vivi's going to bring Howdy in right now. 
Here we are. Woo! Phoebe, we are at a grand total. Not a grand total, because we're continuing it. We're at 25,496.69. Nice. Oh my god! Howdy was so excited, he had to jump out of my arms. <laughs> Great work, everybody! Um, are you Howdy? smelling me? Because I smell like Howdy. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, everyone says hi, Phoebe. Um, hi. Uh, RP, RPKB, we'll have to get to you another time. Caitlin Crow as well. School of Necromancy. With, so when you join, donate to Tiltify, it should keep it in there. We're going to try to, like, screenshot all of those to make sure we get the characters that people want. Anonymous, thanks for the four. Anonymous, thanks for the five. Anonymous, thanks for the $1,000 donation. That was from That's earlier. Insane. I can't believe that. Uh, Anonymous, thanks for ten. A dollar and one cent from Anonymous. Twenty dollars from... Another anonymous person, thirty-two ninety-nine from Gustav Sawyer, an anonymous with a t another twenty dollars and one cent. Now a dollar ninety-nine from Fix the Sixty-Nine. A lot of people are trying to fix the Sixty-Nine. Allie Hackett has given twenty-five dollars. The Hackett twins, as we know, uh, you know, you got to show your Hackett. Uh, this is especially <laughs> interesting. The two of us. Uh, oh, oh yeah. Peppermint Preston. You got the hack it. Uh, your pal DK with the 222. Give Allie a raccoon tanuki st uh, statue in Animal Crossing. Yes. I I don't have one, actually. But I will find one. Wait, what is that? I'm I'm still learning about AC, you know. So a uh, tanuki is like a Japanese little, like, you've probably seen those, like, kind of raccoon statues. But Tom Nook and those two uh, little, like, boy raccoon people, <laughs> those are tanuki. Oh, cute. Uh, Inky, I don't know astrology, but I need Allie to read your chart. Thanks for the 20. Uh, $51 from Rachel Lirius. $5.78 from uh, Amanda. Rachel Lirius gave another 25 Just rounding it up. Thank you. Ghost, uh, thanks for the 2861. Black Lives Matter, now and forever. Heart. That's so cute. Kay Dizzle, thanks for the 50 Hope this helps. Keep up the good work, Black Lives Matter. Thank you. It does help. Wormwood Gaming, rated, of course. Saw all these follows. Uh... Uh, Erna, K Glue, thanks for the 180. This is adding on to a previous donation for a character of my own and someone else because it looks like that's an option. Uh, it's like a good boy, any gender, for who, uh, for some reason, doesn't speakable crimes. <laughs> and down with the guy being made off screen uh, due to said unspeakable crimes. <laughs> wow. Uh, thank you, uh, Una. Uh, anonymous, thanks for the four. And I think we're up to date there. Uh, wow. Uh, Allie, people want to give you some bells too. So whenever we do this at another time, you know, hell yeah, I'll, I'll get take you some. Them. I I some went. You know bells. what? I absolutely hated the scorpions. They the rush of adrenaline that I get from having to try to catch one. <laughs> but I just made myself do it last night, and I made like a scorpion island, Incredible. and it was I was flying on adrenaline. It's scary because everything else in the game is so not scary. I missed yes. Dark Mystery Cat. I didn't see what was uh I don't see it in here. A Dark Mystery Cat, sorry I missed you. I don't uh don't know where it is. Um it's kind of hard to read through this. Apologies. Uh now um well I'll keep doing tomorrow on the stream me, Murph, Emily and uh Siobhan are playing Diablo three, which should be fun. Oh my we played it a little bit last night to like kind of get our feet wet and it's it's very fun um and yeah this has been great you know we're still crushing those donations i thought we would maybe make 2000 this week we're up to twenty five thousand five hundred dollars which is so huge incredible. and maybe we get to 30 by the end of the weekend maybe not but you know it's been really incredible what time for the stream tomorrow 11 a.m again uh that's when we're planning on it so we'll see you then might try to like come up with like fun, you know, like for like ten bucks, twenty bucks, or whatever. We'll we'll do certain, we'll play on certain difficulties or whatever. Don't have those uh, things going yet. Uh, I'm going to look at the stream manager. I would like to raid uh, raid Secret Sleepover Society, of course, but I also want to raid like a, a, any like cool, uh, just any uh, black. Uh, people on Twitch that uh, to to expand their platform. I think that I think now's a great time to do that. Um, I've been trying to do that all week. If anyone has uh, anyone online that they'd love to raid, uh, I'd love to show the support that way. Um, does anyone? Urban Bohemian. Let me look at their thing. Sorry, one second. 
Um, <laughs> wow, the birth charts. Sorry, one second. I just don't know. Okay, great. Yeah, this seems great. Let's do that. Uh, they're raising. It seems like they're raising money for the bail project as well. Um, awesome. So let's. We're gonna raid Urban Bohemian. Uh, they're playing Animal Crossing, of course. Uh, so I know everyone here will love that. Uh, and we'll see you Saturday. Let me get that raid started. Um. Yee! All right. Uh, we're gonna start the raid. Um, Allie, any last thoughts? Any any last? Uh... This was very very fun. And um, <laughs> for having me. It, thank you for your character input. It's been yeah, enlightening. I'll be back. I, I would totally do more of these. Yes, please. Would love to have you. Um, Someone just donated a thousand dollars, or no? Wait, no, that was from a while ago. Sorry, quite bad. <laughs> uh, all right, we're gonna, let's rate them. Uh, go show some love to Urban Bohemian. Rating now. Um, okay, Allie, I think we are. Let's see. I just kind of want to make sure this went through. Very funny. I've forgotten how to speak. Aw.